Hey folks, JD here, and today we're going to be looking at Depths of Insanity, an independent game created by Sloppy Joe Studios. Now this particular game is a first person shooter action adventure RPG, and it features a load of independent bands and artists as little cassette tapes that you pick up on your way around. In this game you play a character called Slaug, this guy right here. He's a little weird alien that has crash landed on a planet and you've got to get him back off it. In the meantime, during this game, you're going to find loads of interactions from millions of different characters. There are um, there's first person shooter elements, there's action elements, there's, there's adventure elements. This game is a real, real mix of a load of different gaming genres. So this is your spacecraft and we have to extinguish those flames. So let's go and find ourselves a bucket exactly as Slaug just said let's go and find something to fill up with water so there's a watering hole right in front of us before we have a little look at this if I just scroll back on the mouse wheel you'll notice that we are missing our watch this is another mini quest that you have without the watch you can't get into important parts of the game you can't see the map you can't save so finding the watch after extinguishing the fire for your spacecraft is your main second objective let's just have a quick look at the main quests so, first of all, this is what you've got to do, and in this order. Put out the fire on, around the spacecraft, retrieve the control unit, gather materials like stones, wood and iron, set up a small establishment somewhere nearby, and explore the planet for clues as to why Slaug's spacecraft lost control and crashed on this particular planet. So, let's have a little read of this sit on the side here, blah 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 blah. Free water, use a bucket. So we don't have an inventory, we don't have a bucket until, we don't have an inventory rather, so we can't use, uh, until we find our watch. So we can't have a little look to see if we already hold a bucket, we don't, so we have to find one nearby. This isn't a bucket, this is a little chest, you'll find them dotted around the place. Inside them, uh, you will find credits. And here's our bucket. So if we pick up the bucket, we now go and fill it up in the water just by jumping into the water. Now the bucket is full and we can douse three fire clusters. So to get out, we got to press C. This is a great jump mechanic. Rather than pressing forward and jump like you do in most games nowadays, you just press the C button and you jump four spaces in front of yourself. Here's our spacecraft and I've just stood on some glass shards. Brilliant. So that's, he will automatically pick them up anyway. See, even if you did try and click on them, you're not going to be able to pick them up. Right. So let's put the fire out. You have to stand quite close to the fire, press space to interact, and then the fire is extinguished. As each bucket only holds enough water to put up three fire clusters, we've got to go back and fill up the bucket again. Fortunately, there are only six fire clusters around the spaceship, so we only have to do this twice. So if we head back now, then the fire this time, we've extinguished the fire inside, now we've got to extinguish the fire on the outside. So again, stand quite close, press space to interact, and the water will automatically extinguish the fire. Now that is done, we get to pick up our little control panel. So the spacecraft is saved, now we need to repair it. So we need to mine trees, rocks, and other useful materials. There's uh, red rock, there's gold, there's iron, there's loads of materials out there for you to harvest. So you need to, ha you need to be able to, to, to craft a tool to then create your establishment. The control unit from your spacecraft will help us en route. That's a little bit strange. What was that? I don't know if any of you noticed, you can go back and have a look. There was a gigantic rock here. Something seems to have destroyed the rock, but this means that we can now advance this way. So let's go east at least. Now earlier on, I was referencing a watch. This is where you find it. So right in front of you, there's Slaug's watch. Perfect. So let's pop it on. I'm loving all the retro feel of this game. The harkening back, the, 60, uh, the 56k modem dial up here. And when it's all up to date, and <laughs> there's more floppy sound effect, brilliant. A log app will open and it's really cool that you can, you can add your own notes to remind yourself where things are. You can add map references to go back and look at for later. So for now, the log app is going to open. So I'm going to create a new note. I'm going to entitle it JD. And then I'm going to call it, um, don't lose your watch again. 
idiot. And then we're going to save that note. There we are. So useful tips. You'll hear a little noise whenever you come... That sound effect there. You'll hear that little sound whenever you come really close to uh, something really useful that you can pick up. So now we've picked up the watch. You can see we have a HUD in the top left. You can see you've got a picture of Slaug. You've got his health. You've got the amount of uh, credits that you currently own it, that you currently own. And if you've got any weapon equipped as well. Let's have a quick look at this statue. This is a statue commemorating Governor Rumpenstaff. So we've got to find something cool to take back to Slough's, Slough's kids on Planet Horizon. <laughs> Why am I talking to myself? It's a, that's a good question. In this game, you have seasons. So I'm guessing we were just in autumn or fall. Now we're in winter. The seasons will change as you go in through the game. It's really, really, really well thought out. So before we go any further, let's have a quick look at our watch. So by clicking the right mouse button, your watch will automatically load. And that loading animation, I think, is fantastic. This map is one of the best maps I think I've seen in a game of this particular sort. Rather than having you as a waypoint on a map and then having this gigantic map in front of you, this whole map is made up into, into blocks and grid references. So location M10, here's M, and all you do is scroll down to 10 and you will know that you are in this location right here. It makes it really easy for figuring out where you are and where you've got to be. But also, look at the sheer size of this. There are beaches, there are highlands, there's deserts, there's um, scrapyards, there's people's houses you can go into. There's loads of people to interact with throughout this world. So with that, I'm going to save my progress. You can see I've played this quite a, quite a bit. Um, so we're going to save our progress there. And then we're going to crack on. So if I scroll back now on the mouse wheel, now that we've picked up the watch, we get this nice little HUD as well. So let's put our flashlight on. Look at that. Rather than having a piddly little flashlight, we get one with a proper feel of, of, of depth and width as well. So until we, we get ourselves a tool, we can't get past these rocks. But as soon as we get a pickaxe, the world is our oyster and we can, we can start bashing everything. So there's only one way to go, as every other way around here is blocked off. And that is towards the Living Festival. A dress up contest and you win a thousand credits or a thousand coins. Um... If you win, I bet Slaug wins because he's dressed up. Oh, not even dressed up. He is an alien, right? So here we go. This is a little bit of a jump tutorial. Very, very, very handy. So if we pull back on the mouse wheel again, I'm going to enable the jump distance and compass. Oh, or did I disable it? There we are. You can see you've got the jump distance and compass because you can see north, south, east, west, little, little waypoints on the floor. But also those waypoints tell you how far you can jump. Like I can see that when I jump now, I'm gonna land on that on, on that pillar in front of me and pick up this sword. So 100 swings before this sword breaks or we can craft this sword into other things. So if I r scroll back on the mouse wheel, click on melee, click on rusty sword, we now have a sword attached or equipped rather. If I keep on going across here, there's a little, little chest. Let's jump across, let's pick up a bomb. So not everywhere you can go. There are great big expanses where you can just fall to the floor like you can see there. There are also spikes. So if I go back the way I came, then we can go a slightly different direction and I can show you a really cool thing about when you jump over spikes. A lot of games will have you jump over spikes but get injured in the process. This game is not like that. So if I come over here, if I remember this is, yeah, there we go, well that was close. No, wrong way. Let's jump over the spikes. It's, it's still a good tutorial to show you. Jump over the spikes. And die. Well, didn't expect that to happen. So let's continue from there. Now that we've saved, let's have a quick little look. Uh, it's, it's got a bit dark. Let's have a quick little look and see if we can equip a flashlight. Pull back on the scroll wheel and you'll see flashlight on or off. Pop it on and you get a really good looking flashlight that gives you some proper, a, a, a proper feel to it. Rather than having a little flashlight that has a piddly light that doesn't do anything, this actually illuminates quite a lot of areas. Now we can't get through any of these parts yet because they're all covered by rocks. We've got to find our pickaxe which we find in the next area. So let's continue forward. Again, can't go through there because of the pickaxe. But if we head towards the Living Festival, 
where there's a dress-up contest, we could win a thousand credits. And I bet you Slough might win that. So, if we go back to here, we then head into a new area. This is kind of a bit of a jump tutorial on how to use the, the, the compass. So, if I, if I check first to see if the compass is on. Yeah, the compass is on automatically. So, as you move forward, see that little black square in front of you? You have a compass, north, south, east, west. That also shows you where you can and can't jump. So when that little black icon is on the part you want to jump to, you can get there safely and you won't die. If it's hanging in midair like this, then that means you will die and nobody wants that. <laughs> so let's jump onto this platform, pick up a sword. Now that we've got a rusty sword, we can use it for approximately 100 swings. So let's pull back on the, on the mouse wheel, click on melee, click on rusty sword. You now have a sword attached or equipped. If we just go up here slightly, there is a little chest. Jump over to it, we pick up a bomb. So I'm going to go back the way I came now, because we, there's no more, there's no way you can go that way for the second until we pick up a pickaxe, and our pickaxe is over here. So moving forward, jump across successfully. Now there is, yeah there we go, you want to just drop down here. Now this is quite an interesting part, in a lot of games you go to jump over spikes and the spikes will kill you or at least take a little bit of health off you in this game they don't you can jump over them very successfully i like that jump across and there's a little chest here if you open the chest there's a pickaxe now the big thing about this game is you haven't got to be equipping or different uh, weapons or different utilities all the time so if i get back onto land safely i shall show you what it what you mean so in front of me is a rock. I've still got my sword equipped, but if I press space, then automatically I can use the pickaxe. Space doesn't just work for the pickaxe. It works for the hammer when you pick that up. It also works for other tools of, uh, of similar, similar ilk as well. So rather than you having to go into your inventory and keeping on equipping, unequipping, equipping, unequipping, you've always got those equipped. So let's pick up our little friend. Here's our little friend, little hamster dude. Hamster durable guinea pig pet so there we go that's what we're going to call him very affectionately i'm going to name him pet 1b so pet 1b now follows you and comes with you on your quest and around here when we get the axe in the next area we can chop down all these trees so if we go down here we are going to come to our our base of operations here we go. So remember when we picked up the bomb in the last place, we're going to need that bomb now so we can get access to this area. So, if I open the quick menu, I'm going to turn off my flashlight for a second because that's not needed. So let's write down the important places in the app anyway. So I'm going to put down JD, I'm going to put down home. Home. There we are, guess my, my H key isn't working very well. There we are, so we've saved that. So in front of us is a rock, push space on the rock, the bomb is automatically deployed and will blow up that rock for us. Here is our axe. Now in the same way as we used the pickaxe a little while ago, you can use that axe to chop down trees. Haven't got to equip it, haven't got to you know, do anything, it's just automatically equipped, you can use it. Same as when we pick up this saw. The saw can be used in crafting, come on, there we go. The saw can be used in crafting when you've built yourself a little crafting area over the back there. Let's pick up these nice 200 credits. Let's head forward. I'm going to spend a bit of time just getting rid of this wood, all the wood and all the stones in the area just so that we've got a nice little nice little resources to take with us because you can you can build things around the place. You can build them from your uh, from your uh, from your build program here. You and you have to be back in this particular area when you do build. But it's always a good idea to clear up an area when you're in it. Res mine as many resources as you possibly can. It's a really quick process, as you can see. But the result being that you will be able to craft a lot more from these resources. So if I come over here, there's a rock over here. Underneath this rock is a well. Now we've got full health. But water can restore Slough's health. As well as different soda cans, uh, potato chips and other things you pick up along your way. So I think we haven't got a grass cutter for the second, so all we can do is get rid of the trees and the stones, and we've accomplished that. 
Now, if I just have a quick look at the build program, not going to look at that yet. So we're going to the build program. We need a, a bonker bashing tool. So in order for that, we need to go back the way we came, and we need to head back to our spacecraft because right close to our spacecraft is let's get rid of these trees is a hammer. Have I gone the wrong way? No, that's it. Get rid of that tree. That's it. Head back this way. I'm gonna. I'm still gonna be taking these trees because it's always good just to mine everything as we're there. Come on, in you go. And now we're gonna go back to the jumping area. Let's. Oh, let's. Oh. oh well, there's no area there which is gonna kill me, so I'll just jump up that way. There we go. So if we keep going this way, now that we've got a pickaxe, we haven't got to go back this way again. We can go a different direction. But we do need to get that bonking tool. <laughs> In other words, the hammer. So through we go. Almost there. And we should be right in the, in the area. Yep, here we are. So if you take a right past your spacecraft, keeping on going, you will find a toilet covered in flies. The flies will hurt you, but you can just, you don't spend that much time there until you, uh, while, while you're picking up that sort of that, um, that, that hammer. Now you can escape. And to be fair, they don't really take a lot of health off you. Let's dive into this next area because there's lots of trees and wood for us to mine. And then what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to go a di slightly different way. I'm not going to go back the way I came. I'm going to go this way instead because this ends us into a little forest, I think. So where are we? We are L10. So L10 is down here. There, crash site. So yeah, we should be going probably this way, I think, into Pinewood Low. Let's get rid of that tree as well. And I think this is where we come across some of our first characters, if I remember the, to go the correct way. So, in through the dense forest. And then eventually, we're going to get ourselves into a new part of the forest. There are loads of enemies around here too. There are skeletons, there are zombies, there are half-turned zombies. There are, look, there are little tags on the floor to tell you that you're in a, in a skeleton area. So we will see them walking around. They don't really do a lot to you. They do take health off you. Um, and you have got to have a certain a certain weapon to kill them. Some of the some of the rusty swords just don't do them any damage. But it's worth you trying to hit them anyway. And if, if you don't see any damage meter on them, then just uh, just give up with that and just run away. Because they are quite slow. You can get away from them quite easily. And I'm hoping I was going to come across a few to show you, but not right now. They must be hiding. I mean, just, if I hold down on shift, I can run around quite successfully. No, nothing? No, okay, fair enough. They must be hiding. Well, we can head outside. The areas are, are different, as you can see there. We just passed through a very light-looking door. There we go. So let's hack down this spider's web. There we go. And now we are outside. So around here is a really cool little dude that um, will put a, will will for two hundred credits will offer you a challenge. If you win the challenge, then there he is. If you win the challenge then he gives you a little prize. So let's let's take him up on that challenge. The little contest is to swim through these six strange looking contraptions over his right shoulder where there are going to be six rings. And then go back to him all within the allotted time limit. And the first time I did this, I failed massively. Um, but I found a trick. And the trick is if you hold down the shift key, then you really go very quick. It's almost the same key as, as when you run. Enables fast mode, running mode, dash. Go down the one side, turn around to the bottom and come back up the right hand side. And um, generally you get to him with about 10 seconds left. Generally. There are times where I failed, but I think this 
this run looks decent enough. There are a couple of obstacles in your way, you just swim around them. There we go. There's one obstacle, swim around that. Sometimes as well, depending on how your other camera is facing with the, with the mouse, if you move, you try and sidestep in the water, it can actually speed you up as well. Or this is going to be very, very close. 12, 11 seconds. I'm a little bit slower on this run. There we go, did it. Within five seconds. <laughs> oh, he called me lazy as heck. He's given me a soda. So what the soda will do, you can go into your items and you can see the soda and the soda will give you extra uh, HP and PP as well to recover your sorry ass. So... <laughs> There you go. It's fun. You get it done. If you don't do it, if you don't completely uh, su successfully complete it, he dumps you the other side of the water, and then that's a little bit of a job to get out. You can get out though, but it's a little bit frustrating. So let's continue. Let's go back into the forest this time, because there's. I'm trying to remember. I think it's this way. I'm trying to remember where. There he is. See the green light glow in. That's where we're heading. Because this is the radioactive waste. And around here there should be a house. There it is. A castle. This is the Iron Force clan. So around here there's lots of skeletons. There's a few zombies. But there is a, an individual that we need to interact with. So if we just go through here. Then you'll come across some steps. Somewhere. I think it's here. Yeah, there it is. And up these steps is one character. There he is. That we were talking about earlier. This is ca character Rumpin' Stuff. So he's got a brain. So you need the brains in order to power your spacecraft. But he's not going to let you have them unless you can beat him in three different games. Now this is Rock, Paper, Scissors, Game Trivia, which is excellent. Infuriating, but excellent. And another one as well I can't remember. But this is well worth you doing, right? Because he'll talk you through the uh, uh, the um, atrocities that Dr. F. Rogman, uh, great name by the way, um, came up with, and why this whole town and city has all you know gone to hell. And then right at the very end, he'll give you a brain if you best him. So basically, Dr. F. Rogman has been doing lab experiments, and the frog started to gain in size. He started to evolve and learned how to speak. The frog took over the scientist's work. The source of eternal energy was contained inside different animals' brains. So far, eight brains have the gene of eternal energy. One of them is in Dr. F. Rogman. He's took all of his keys that gives access to the labs. You might have figured it out already, but his name is Dr. Rumpenstuff, the mayor. People around town have, uh, have some ways to still get inside the lab. Dr. F. Rogman's plan is to use this energy on human subjects and evolve himself. If he gets all the brains into one subject that can contain them all, he thinks that uh, he thinks uh, the whole planet, planet Tellus, where you currently are, uh, would become a new burning sun. Uh, doc, um, the mayor has slipped out the sewage drains of toxic, toxic waste and ended up like this. He has one of the brains and he can't decide what to do with it. This is why we've got to battle him to then get those brains. So, now Slog has told him that we're not from around here. And he wants us to play three games and we want to talk to him. He ha wants us to talk to him the next time that we want to play those games, which is going to be right now. But first of all, in all retro games, always look behind things because you never know what you're going to find. So let's go and talk to him. Let's play rock, paper, scissors first. Now, the only way I found to get around this is if you keep on picking the same. Um, there we go. I tried going through different ways, tried paper. To try picking rock, paper, scissors, or whatever, and it didn't work. If you pick the same one over and over again, you will eventually get round it, at least in this particular version. Now that we've bested him in rock, paper, scissors, let's guess his favourite colour. So I'm going to start at the top and guess pink. Right, okay, great. So I was going to go green, but I thought maybe he's a little bit annoyed because he's now green. Now let's answer the retro games trivia. So let's go. Let's see how good my 30 years of gaming has been. What is Guy Guybrush Threepwood's nemesis? LeChuck. Um, what's the name of the sequel to Manic Mansion? 
I think that was Day of the Tentacle. Yeah. What is the name of the program you can play all point and click adventures on? Is it one, two, three? Or is it. No, it's not going to be point and click eternal, that's too obvious. No, okay, I've got to start over again. So let's answer the five questions. If you start over again, by the way, the rock, paper, scissors, and the fa pick your favourite colour, that you haven't got to start doing that again. You've just got to go back to where the, 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 the last particular one that you failed. So what's a sentence from full throttle from the full throttle game intro? Yeah, when I think of Maureen, I think of two things. Asphalt on trouble. What makes the main character grow in a mushroom kingdom? Oh mushrooms. Haha, <laughs> that, that's nicely worded. What does the blue hedgehog do best? <laughs> Runs fast. How many coins do you need for an extra life in the Mushroom Kingdom? It's a hundred. What happens in the intro of the Day of the Tentacle? A bird chokes from toxic waste, I think, isn't it? I'm going to go with that. Yeah! Yeah, we bested him! Perfect! So now, do I get that brain? Oh, I picked up the soda. But do I get the brain? Yes! I was waiting for him to say, oh, hang on, do something else. But no, we get the brain. The end of Mr. Rump and stuff. Oh, is he gonna is he gonna terminate it too and just go into the well not lava but the fat of green goop? Toxic waste has started to affect his body. Doesn't look like this before. I was a healthy, good looking mayor of the city. Take this old photo of me if you want uh, if you happen to go that way. Oh sorry man. Thanks for your help in the brain and stuff. Oh there he is, look. Oh bless him. Okay, well, we've got that anyway in his memory. Thanks for your help, dude. Now let's see where we got to go. So we, 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 we're, we're nailing this. We've got a load of wood. We've got a load of stone. We've got some glass. We've got the first of eight brains. We've got seven left. We're in P to Q, 11 to 15. So P to Q, 11 to 15. So yeah, we're down here in Pinewood Low. Okay, let's give it a quick save. And then we'll see where we've got to go next. So I'm just going to run around and see if we can find ooh, our next place to go. What the hell was that noise then? I haven't got my sword equipped for some reason, so I'm going to re-equip that. There we go. Let's go through. Oh, there's some skeletons. Run, run, run. Ooh, a hangman's noose. Oh, more skeletons. I'm not going to try and battle them with my rusty sword because it's not going to work. So I'm just going to run around a bit. Ah, here's some, some mud. But we need a shovel to get that mud. There's loads of stuff for you to mine and then make things. Yeah, lever opens the door. Toxic waste. Uh, ah, it's the chest. He needs a key to open this up. A silver lock. Oh, it's going to be down one of these holes, isn't it? What's in this one? Oh, I reckon it's going to be in there. Silver key with a silver skull with a skull shaped engraving. Well, that 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 chest had a skull engraving on the front of it. See? So what are we going to get? Found an odd human skull. Might be part of a puzzle. Sweet. Okay. Well, if there's a puzzle that needs a, a odd human skull to uh, to solve it, we now have that skull. Okay. Can't go that way. I think there's no way, nothing else to do in here other than for me to leave. Can I interact with this? No. Okay. Oh, hang on, ladder. Oh. Ooh, what's that? This could come in handy. Six depois. Depoises. Oh, cures for a poisonous state. Nice. Okay, let's keep running around the battlements for a second then, in case there's other, th other stuff up here. Oh, hang on, there is. There's a chest. Ooh, found 390 credits. Okay, I'm going to jump outside there. Nice. Okay. Oh, oh, maybe I was meant to come this way. This looks really inviting. <laughs> okay, I came the wrong way then. It looks like I was meant to come down this way. So that the cutscene would play. Okay. Well, apologies, I went the other way. Whoa. Skeletons everywhere. Ooh. What's this way? Bash down the stone. Oh, it's just back from where I started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. 
I do like how a lot of the different ways all end up back to where you came from. I really like that. Multiple ways ending up in the same place. That's very, very cool. There's nothing worse than playing a game, getting confused as to where the hell you are, or should I say me playing a game, getting confused to where the hell I am, and <laughs> not being able to find my way back. Okay, let's keep running. I want to eventually end up back outside. Oh, oh, oh. All these skeletons coming after me. That's the... Let's head this way then. Oh. I might just go in the wrong way. Yeah, do you know what? I'm going to head out that way. Because at least I'm back in an area without um, skeletons. So I went that way last time. Let's see which other ways we can go and what else we can discover. Okay, I need a bomb to blow up that. Right, okay. So I need to get some more bombs. Let's go back this way then. Let's uh, get rid of these stones first. Because it's all going to help towards me building my establishment. And I'll be back at the jumping... Oh no, not back at the jumping puzzle yet. Oh, but we can go this way now. So let's, let's go this way. Well, actually, before we do that, there looks like there's an area over there too, didn't there? So let's, as we've got our pickaxe, let's spend a little bit of time here and exploring what we have in this area. So this just looks like... Can I chop these trees down? No? Okay. Just looks like there's a... Ooh, a hidden chest with 50 credits. Okay, nice. What's this way? Okay. This looks like it could be interesting. It's obviously blocked off for a reason. And usually that means big scary monsters. So let's let's keep going. Oh, I want to match up that jumping compass. Oh, look! It's another sword. Perfect. That one's, again, fine for 100 swings. So let's jump and jump again. Let's get rid of that stone. Jump, jump. Sweet. Okay, so we've, for now, completed this area anyway. So let's, let's head, or, or have we? I've just realised that I think I just passed somewhere else to go. Sorry, but what's down here? <gasps> it's a chicken! Hello, dude! Oh, is this going to follow me? Oh, I found a chicken. Oh, no, it's a chicken weapon. Yes, please. Yes, please. So ranged chicken. <laughs> it's like um, it's like postal with the with the cat gun. Brilliant. Oh, look at that! I'm gonna have so much fun with this. But for now, let's um, let's save him. I don't want to. Uh, I'm guessing. Yeah, there you go. Let's put him away. I don't. I want to use him in a real world scenario where I can fling eggs at people. Um, and I don't know how many of those chickens are going to come across either. That might be the only one in the game. Right. So we're back at our 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 abode. So now, the last time we were here, we needed to get the mallet. So let's see if we can build anything now. So if we build, can we build a basic workbench? Yes, we can. Beautiful. There you go. So now we've built that, we can... Oh, hang on, I took a bit of damage, didn't I? Let's get some some health from the water. And let's see what else we can build. So I can build a music player. Ah, this is for the tapes that you can pick up. So the, ind the in independent artists in this uh, that, that have allowed their music to be used in this game, you can hear them by picking up music tapes and by fighting the big end-of-level bosses or end-of-world bosses. So you can build a music player. That's good to know. You don't go around and you don't pick it up, but you can build it. So you can build a slug monument. Build a golden thing. like the idea of that. Build a fireplace. Yeah, let's do that. I don't want to waste the wood I've got, but at the same time, I would like to build up my abode a little bit. And there's our fire. Um, what else? Put together a mini-map. Okay, well, I don't have a mother modem. So, okay, fine. So I think we've done everything that we can do here for now. So, let's look at our map. And let's figure out where we're going to go. So I reckon we head off into the shopping districts. That's where I reckon we go. So I think if we go back out to where I was swimming with this geezer, round about here, I think it was, the Dino Sea, and if we head up the neck of the sea, 
we can get to the gas station and then that then should open up the whole of the town for us. So let's give it a bit of a save. And then let's let's head out. So which is the easiest way to go? Probably back through Actually, no, let's go this way. Because I did see there was another way out. And I did not utilize that way out on, uh, previously. So jump, 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 get rid of the stone, get rid of the stone, jump again, jump again, and then through this way. What's this way? Oh, well, this is definitely not ominous, isn't it? This looks really sinister. I must go inside. To be fair, mate, I would probably think exactly the same. Okay, I don't like the look of this, so I'm going to equip my, uh, my chicken. <laughs> oh, let's equip my chicken and use the chicken on the zombie. Hey, check. Hey, zombie. Oh, made light work of that zombie. And in the chest, we found 50 credits. Oh, I picked up some iron. Excellent. Okay, let's have a, let's have a good look around here. Anything around here? No. Nothing to interact with. Okay, let's keep going. Can I get... Oh, look, that's what... When we went to see uh, Dr. Rumpenstuff, or the Mayor Rumpenstuff, and he said that there were four keys, this looks like one of the keys that was missing. It's tightly locked. So we need a blue jiggy key. Okay, fine. So let's go and we'll get that jiggy key. There's some more rocks and stones and stuff here to get rid of. Oh, what the hell is that? You feel the urge to touch the pillar? Yeah, absolutely. Oh, oh it's a teleporter. Oh, sweet. Okay, that's good. Because the map looks huge. I'm glad there's a teleporter there. Sorry, Mr. Chicken. Mrs. Chicken. Let's um, change weapon, actually. I, again, don't... Oh, sorry. Wrong button. I don't want to... Overuse that chicken. Righty ho. So there's no way out of this place, so I've got to go back the way that, that I came. That's no problem. Then we can we can do some jumps. Do some jumps. And then we can head out this way. This is back where we found our guinea pig hamster gerbil friend. We didn't go this way though, we turned left and we went down into what would become our abode. Ooh, what's this? This is Moon Moonstone Cemetery. Can I interact with this? I need a shovel. Okay, fine. Is there anywhere else around here or is it just through the, the that um, those pillars? Looks like it's just through those pillars. Okay, well at least we now know where the cemetery is. What's in there? I really want to come back here. When we get a diggity digger, otherwise known as a shovel, we'll uh, be going back through there and seeing exactly what's in there. Right. Let's head back. This is just heading towards our uh, our abode now. We don't need to go that way. So we'll head back the way we came. And then we'll go out to where we swam with that geezer. And then we will head up towards the gas station. There we go. Oh. Yeah, down there. Oh, there we go. Oh no! Oof. Almost died at an absolutely horrible death then. Wow. I don't know if you could tell, but that slightly panicked me. <laughs> Let's head this way. What's over here? Is that a heart? Oh yeah. Nice. Anything else around you to collect? No? Okay, let's go this way a bit then, because now I've got my my pickaxe. We can get rid of these stones and see what's on the outside. Ooh, more credits. Oh, no! No, 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 no! 
Oh, I can't believe I did that. Oh, what? Okay. Well, let's continue then, because we saved it not so long ago, didn't we? We saved it back at the abode. So, let's crack on. So where were we? That's right, we were back here, weren't we? So now we're going to head back to uh, where... We're going to go back through the forest, that's it. And then we're going to head up to the gas station. So let's find a nice easier route now that we know that this way... Yes, it heads us past the skeletons, but it's quite a nice route to get outside, isn't it? Oh. So if I can just remember where the outside is from in here. There. Perfect. Now we are back on the way. There we go. We're back on the way of getting to the gas station. So instead of we came out there last time, we turned left. Now we've turned right. And now we're going to check our map in a second. We're in location the HGJ 7 to 15. So HGJ 7 to 15. So we are in these three blocks here down to there. So we are in the Dino Sea. Great. So let's have a quick little look around here. Bench. Nothing much going on here. Nothing much going on here. Oh, it looks like there's a, a desert over there maybe. Let's uh, Let's run a bit. Because this, uh, this bit is quite vast, looking at the map. So as we're going to keep on hauling ass down here, let's stop off and have a little look. So a nice little bridge. Let's take a walk across it. Oh, I'm loving that fire sound effect. Oh, look. Amazing. Now... In old, in tradition with old games, is there anything behind the waterfall? Because there would be in retro games, and there is in this as well. <laughs> Guaranteed, in old... To, wow, 2500? Oh, nice. Thank you, developer folks. Yeah, that's great, that. Because, you know, guaranteed, in old Tomb Raider, anything like that, there would be... There would be... Um, Something behind the fire, uh, the, the the firewall. Something behind the waterfall. So this would be another area out of the forest where we just were with the skeletons. But we're going to head this way because I want to explore what's outside here. I want to see if we can interact with a load of different uh, different peoples. So where are we? What's in and around here? Let's check every area because I got the feeling that there's going to be some things hidden around here. In good old fashioned retro. Oh, that's going to be another way back into the forest. Let's just check that. So we are H6. So H6. Yeah, there we go. So we can head back in the forest this way. But I want to go this way, the gas station. Okay. But I can see a chest over here, look. Found eight energizers. So energizers are health, they will restore your HP. So let's keep on ahead into that, towards that gas station. And there it is. Amazing. So let's have a little look. Oh, cool. Pick up some sodas. And looks like there's some potato chips over there. There are indeed. Can I open that? Oh, I can. <laughs> That's a crazy chicken. Okay. Oh, okay, I can leave that pool. Okay, so I can only take one chicken at a time. So when my chicken is um, <clears throat> spent, then I can come back and grab that chicken. Oh, dude. First cassette tape marked to hell and back. I need someone to play it on. Okay, but this is our, our, first, collected, our first collected cassette. If I did have the uh, ability to play it, then we could be hearing some of the really cool indie bands that are featured in this game. Again, if you want to check them out, they're in the description. And I recommend very, very highly that you do. So let's keep going. So we're currently facing west. So what is west? West will take us... If we're here facing west. West will take us, I'm guessing, through... Never eat shredded wheat. So west will take us this way, will it? Hmm, interesting. Or will it take us up to the parking shopping, dis uh, shopping districts? Let's, let's keep going. Let's have a look. So if we head this way... Where are we off? AF Emerald Harbour. 
Okay, yeah, so we, we are here now then. Emerald Harbour District there. Okay, cool. So let's have a little look around the harbour then, I guess. As we're here, let's dive into this hole. See what is in this next world. Oh, what? Beware, don't enter the maze unprepared. Countless people lost themselves in here and have never returned. Oh, great. Well, because of the way I think, I'm going in. <laughs> Absolutely. So, let's try this ladder. Oh my god. Okay, I'm reconsidering going in here now. Look at the absolute size of this. Okay, yeah, maybe this is not a good idea. Oh my god, look at the sight. Oh, there are enemies. There are enemies. There's a house. What's in that house? Whoa, what was that back there? Okay, I'm sufficiently intrigued. We're going in. Come on, folks. Grab your so sword. Grab yeah, why not? Grab your sword. Let's, um... Is that a map? Can I take that? Oh, yeah. Oh, perfect. What's that gigantic circle in the middle? Right, yeah. Do you know what? We're... Yeah, I'm sufficiently um, testosterone up. Let's get in here. This is... Um, let's have a little look and see what we can find. Old trees. Hang on. This is interesting. I think I just figured something out. It, do you think these different coloured blocks are pointing you the way to go? There's none there. But there was certainly one that pointed the way this way. Almost like it's saying, come on, come into the come into the into the maze. And then there's nothing. And then there's one there. <laughs> Listen to the music in the morning. I'm gonna follow this and see what we end up with. Yeah, look, it looks as if it's pointing us in a direction. Where's it taking us? Oh god, is there gonna be a gigantic monster over here? the hell is that? A green mysterious stone. I better hold on to this. Okay, clearly that's a quest item that we haven't properly... I don't understand why yet. So, I think if I see any more of those coloured blocks on the floor... Yeah, there's no coloured blocks here, look. I think if I see more of those coloured blocks on the floor, I'm going to follow them. Because the one coloured block that I, that I followed led us to that green mysterious stone. So I wonder if there's any more that lead us. Ah, oh, yeah, look. Where's this? Is this? Let's follow this. No, I'm going away from it. Okay, I'm going to run through here because this is a, a giant place. It splits off. Does that, do you think that reconvenes in front of itself? Like as if it goes around to the right and left and then just meets in the middle. Oh, uh, right, okay. Yeah, I think I've, I think I've figured this out. I don't know why we're picking up these stones. But... I think the floor is coded. As in, you know, follow the green line or whatever in the hospital you get to this particular department. I think that's what this is. We're following these to get the green stones. Why do we need the green stones? I have no idea. But I'm going to keep following them and then see where I end up. Yeah, look, another one. Okay, I have no idea. Right, okay. <laughs> Sorry, this is not much of a walkthrough. I have no idea where I'm going. So which way did I come? I came that way, didn't I? So let's go this way then. Well, this is just going to send me back... Oh, dear God. This is just going to send me back around there. That's a dead end. Do I really need my light? No. Right, okay, let's get rid Let's ditch the light. Oh, this is just going to send me back around... Oh, no, it's not. It's sending me a different way. From what I can see... From what I've experienced now, this maze feels really... What the hell is that? It's like a... Oh, great. I haven't got a... a weapon. It's like a... 
chicken turkey lizards. There we go, yes. This means you become more acquaintance with the place. Oh, have I leveled up? I've I've create I've also got a second chance orb. Or oh, does that mean if I die? What the hell is that? If I die, I can start back in this area. Oh, interesting. Okay. Now. Oh, that's where I started. Look, there's the there's the ladder I climbed up. Okay. So from what I can see, as I was about to, as I was about to say before I came across that whatever the hell turkey chicken monster thing was, um, I I think this maze is really well developed, really well made, because a maze is not meant to it's not meant to scare and confuse that you know you think you can't ever get out of it. It's meant to disorientate you just enough so you can start making some really weird and random sort of decisions so you don't get to where you're meant to be. What's up there? Where can I A G oh it doesn't give me specific, it'll just give me A to G, so A to G seven to ten. So yeah, I'm here in this great big block. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. I just wanted to see if I could see what was above there maybe. Um, so yeah, as I was saying, it's not meant to it's just meant to slightly disorientate you. And I think this is what it's doing to me. I'm thinking, have I have I been here? Have I followed this this line? Have I and I, I can honestly think, I honestly feel, this is one of those things, I honestly feel a bit disorientated, but I don't feel, you know, I don't feel sort of in danger, silly that as it may sound, I'm playing, oh look there's a little green thing, right I'm going to kill you then, do it in my, come on, oh he's quite sweet, he's got a little cyclops eye going on, and oh bless him, oh, okay, how did this guy die? <laughs> Oh, this rusty sword's only got 50 swings instead of 100. Okay, so I'll, I'll keep that. Let's pick up this orb. This uh, mysterious stone. How many of those stones have I got? Can I see them in my items? So if I go to my item... No, I can't see them. Second chance orb. That was what I picked up from killing that weird thing. No, I can't see how many of those... Okay, I can't see that. Let's save the game anyway. Because I've, um, I'm feeling I'm on, like I'm onto something here, and I don't know what it is. That's a dead end. Is it though? Yeah. I thought it may have been like a doom dead end. You know, you click it and it's a door. There's a few similarities to Doom and this. To be very honest with you, I feel the same sort of excitement playing this as I do playing Doom, even now. Is that that's the way? That's the way I came, isn't it? So what's this way then? I don't know how many of those green stones I've got. I would say at least five. At least five. I mean, I don't even know what they're used for. I don't even know how many there are. So I I guess I'm going to just try and get into that great big middle bit that we see on the map. I'm guessing those little green squares on the map in the top left, or in the sort of just under the top left, is the green squares I've been picking up. So let's see... That way either. Okay, let's go straight on this way. No dead end again. See, it's disorientating. I think to myself, yeah, I haven't been here, and I have been here. Just like a maze is meant to do. It's great. Okay, let's follow that that line then. Not that way. This way. Big stone. Let's take a right here, as before I went straight on. Take a right, take a right, follow this down. And then, where are we heading? Are we going this way? This looks like, is this back to the beginning? Oh no, what's this? Oh yeah, this is back to the beginning. Right, well I went that way, didn't I? Because I, I stood up on the ladder. So let's go this way. Redstone, can I mine that? Oh, okay, so I need to find some really strong explosives to get rid of that. I feel as if there's a part of this I haven't been to other than the great big circular bit in the middle. 
but oh no dead end again okay what's this way I'm gonna go this way my dog barking I think my dog's trying to tell me which way to go yeah go that way go that way dad go that way um oh was that where I just came from oh no <laughs> I feel as if this might be a new new area. Is this a new area? Do you know what? Let's go. Let's figure this out together, folks. We're gonna all get hopelessly lost together. Now this way. Well, I haven't seen any more of those green stones, and I think I've been here before. I haven't seen any more of those green stones, so maybe I've got them all. I mean, also maybe not, but I feel as if. Oh, what's this? I haven't been this way. Oh, the music has changed. Have I gone the right way? I think I may have done. Let's run this way. I haven't been this way before. Ooh, what's this way? Ooh. Another green stone this way, do you think? Oh no, I'm back. I'm back there, but I, this all this place here looked new. So let's go back to here, is there? No, there is nowhere else. Oh. Where am I going? Right, okay. That just has me back out to, to that line. What's down here? Just another dead end. What's up this way? A loop back round to there. What's down here? Oh, blue guy. I haven't been this way then. There we are. He's gone. He's gone. So I don't know if they randomly spawn or if there is a... Can I attack this? Can I mine it? No. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, there's a, new, there's a green orb. There's a green gem box thing. Oh, my rusty sword is shattered. But I've got, I've got a grilled chicken. And i got another second chance orb. Brilliant. And I've found this. A green mysterious stone. So, let's just count them on the map. One, two, three, four, five, six. I reckon I've, I reckon I've got all six now question now is what do I do with it so let's keep running there has to be a way to get to that circular middle I haven't been to that gigantic circular middle bit yet so let's let's get there keep running so it's a shame you can't see yourself on a map. The one way I'm thinking it'd be nice to have a little waypoint. The other part of me is thinking this is properly retro, because in the old, in in, in the if you haven't played the older games that, that I grew up with, there was there was a map, but there were no waypoints. There was no sort of like you have to go this way and you have to go that way. Uh, okay. Do you think that I got to break those red pillars to get in there? Do you think that's the circular middle? I really don't know where I am. <laughs> oh, this is great. Oh, oh, no, that's... I went through there, didn't I? What's that way? Oh, what's that? Ooh. Come on. I found dynamite. Oh, big red rocks. Big red rocks. Right, okay. I've got dynamite. So then I can... Wrong way. So then I can blow up those big red rocks, big red rocks. So I remember which way I went for those. This way. Follow the red brick rock road. It's nothing. I don't know what that was either. Uh, this way. Okay, great. Great. Let's... There should be a big red rock around here. Hey. Where's that big red rock? 
Oh shoot, have I gone the wrong way? I see no big red rocks. Okay, back actually it was fall of the black line, wasn't it? And then head this way, and then it was that way. No. Hmm. <laughs> Hang on, it was this way, wasn't it? Yes, big red rock, big red rock. Ah, yes. Amazing. Amazing. Big circular area. Amazing. <gasps> this is our song. Dear God, this is our song. <laughs> Watch out for the monster lurking somewhere here. What monster? Oh no! Oh crap, that monster! No! Right. I want to... No, I don't want to do that. I want to run away from all this first. Oh, is this a new weapon? Spiked club. Nice. Nice. Run, run, run. Oh, I just see, look, those green things I was picking up are in the heads. Um, rusty sword. No, I don't want that. I want um No! I'm panicking now. Ah, uh, no! Uh, I don't want to die! Okay, cool. And then I want a ranged chicken. Ah, uh, no! No! This is all going wrong! We? What? What? What's happened? No! No, no, no! Oh, I got a second chance, though. Oh, okay, I get to revive. Wow. Okay. Let's, um... Okay, that's a giant pig. Okay, let's get away from him. No, let's get away from him. No! Ah, uh, no, it's all gone to hell! <laughs> get some more energizer on the go. Right, okay. Let's run away. I know I can take out the blue ones using this. Right, he's gone. I can't take out that great big whatever the hell he is using that using that sword so I'm gonna try what what chicken butt so oh it works oh no my chicken exploded didn't think I'd say that today I'm gonna have gonna let's get some energizer on the go let's go back to I haven't got any of those. Let's um, uh, melee. I got a spike club. Haven't tried the spike club. Let's see if I can get this guy. Oh, I can. I can get him with that. Okay, cool. Oh, cool. Good God, I killed him. That was stressful. <laughs> oh, that was stressful. Now what do I do? Can I talk to this geese? Hurry, find all six emeralds for each statue's head. They're hidden in the maze. Right. Okay. So there's one there. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. And there's not one in there. I've still got one more to find. Okay. Oh, look. Oh, there's one there. Oh, I got all of them. <laughs> okay. Meet me at my home, just a bitty step to the east from here. I have a cool thing or two I, wanna, I, I want you to have. And I'll have my revenge on Dr. F. Frogman for sacrificing me to the greater good. Okay, great. Yeah, cool. I'll, I'll come and meet you, man, to the east. And there's a brain. Cool, that's my, my second brain, isn't it? Yeah, I think, it's, I think it's our second brain. So if I go back to a rusty sword, i got plenty of health going on. So I, now I need to, to head east that way. Okay. So let's head east. 
Oh, that was mental hearing our song in that. In that part. Or just in a game. Wow. God, that, I think I was so overcome by hearing that. I didn't have a clue what the hell to do. <laughs> just forgot how to play games. It all went to hell. <laughs> oh, man. Thank you for including Death Pigeon. And for every, every other artist, too. That was... Oh, I found some dynamite. Even better. But... Yeah, no, that was that was that was crazy. That was I didn't did not handle that well. <laughs> okay, we got to head east to go to his uh, to his shack, um, and I'm not heading east. I'm heading west. But can I get back on myself? Yes, now I'm heading east. Right. Oh no. Where am I going? I mean, that was brilliant. Fighting all of that then. The second chance cube is great. That really is a really nice addition because unlike when I fell onto the spikes and died a horrible grisly death, um, that may or may not still be in this video, um, that second chance orb gives you, respawns you right straight back as to where you were. That, that, I really like that. I really like that. Right. Still trying to find his, his, his house. I don't think I'm any closer now than I was when I set out. Because of everything twisting and snaking round, I get there, I get to the east, and then... I get to east, and then I turn round, and then I'm heading west. I know what it looks like, we've seen it a few times. Let's keep going. Maybe I've gone the wrong way. I came out of that pit, didn't I? Um, so let's see if I can get back to that circle in the middle. There was two exits. Maybe I went the wrong way. Maybe it was the other exit. I think it's down here, isn't it? <laughs> Me again, showing how absolutely... Oh, there it is. Okay, so then if I... Oh, hang on, is that another club? It is. Yoink. Oh, okay, I can trade weapons too. Sweet. Right. Is there anything down there? No, nothing. Okay. Where are we going now? Oh, right. That's clearly not where I want to go. Oh, is it? Is that east? No, that's south. He definitely said east, didn't he? Come, come east. Not too far from your east. Is there another exit then? Because that's east. Is it? North, south, east. Yeah, because that was west, isn't it? Yeah, right. Yeah, so it is that way. So where am I? I'm in the centre circle there. And I, I think... Okay, I'm at the centre circle, so I've got to go... There's no way that way either? No. Okay. So let's see if we can continue to find. I went that way, didn't I originally? Why didn't he wait for me and just be like, "Cheers, dude, come follow me back," rather than running back and then telling somebody who's got no sense of direction, i.e., me, which way to go? I mean, not that I think we're never going to get there, but. You know, if you're bored of this, me walking around trying to figure out where the, the maze is and your, uh, or where, where his house is in the maze, and you want to see the next part, have a look in the chapters and uh, and click on to the next bit. I'll probably have one in there of me arriving at the house, and it might save you 45 minutes. No, I opened that, didn't I? That was some more dynamite. That's the way in. Is that east? No, that's north. Is this going to show me again? The, yes, it is. So where are we? We're there. So if I snake through there, keep going that way, and his house is up here, isn't it? Yes, there it is, there. So I follow that very... Right, okay, yeah, I think I've got it. And by that, I mean I absolutely have not got it. Right, so I head... The way that I was looking which is 
which is this way. And then we know we're getting there when there is a very great big black line on the floor which is double thickness. Okay. Oh no, it just sends me through to there. Let's step through there. Where is there? Uh, but no, because I, I can see it in that cube, can't I? So therefore, this isn't the way. Yeah, that's definitely not the way. Oh, look, another tran teleporter. Cool. So now we've got two teleporters activated. Excellent. What's this way? Oh, what's this way? Oh, hang on. Oh, this is his house. I had to go that way. I had to leave to come back. These, this is the great big thick line that we saw from. There it is. Oh dear God, John, dude. Knock, knock, knock. Oh yeah, get get yourself dressed, mate. Please, you know, make yourself decent. Hey, there he is. He wants to give me my lit technology. Oh, is it a shotgun? Just glad you got your clothes on. <laughs> snooze for months okay digital alarm clock oh I mean thank you I'm appreciative but I really would have uh, get yeah I could have died yeah right I would have, I, I thought he's gonna give me that shotgun I can't sorry I need to focus on my next invention meet me at the southern part of Errol Harbour I'll harbor I will try and have a cool thing for you and if you're going south be sure to always keep yourself on the right path Follow the wind or else you'll be lost in the sandstorm. Lots of people have died trying to reach the fountain of youth. If you get there, check out my welding gun. Okay, cool. Thanks, dude. I'm just going to have a little... Oh! Wanted, hunted and tortured. Look at that. There's our tape. Oh, mate. Oh, God. It's amazing. Right. Okay. Where are we going to go? So let's keep looking. So we are, where are we? We are um, here somewhere. So I can go back the way we came. We're not going to go into the desert. I want to go up here, the, the town. I want to see the town. So, nothing in there? No? Okay. Let's go back the way we came. God damn, this game is so much fun. Right, let's let's head this way. And then we're not going to go that way. We're going to head this way and we're going to leave this confounded maze. Yeah, this way, wasn't it? Yeah, and then back. There we go. And then we're going to head right... Ah, dude, they respawn. Ah, so we had octopus, land lizards, spider things. Okay, back this way. There's the tower that I walked up, so therefore there's the exit. There it is. Oh, do you know what? I think I'm getting pretty good at navigating that maze now. 45 minutes later. <laughs> right. Okay, should we have a little run around here first and see as we're here, see what else is here. I'm just going to sneak in around here so I'm not missing any, any, any collectibles. Whoa, ho. Okay. Oh, big hole. Yeah, not going that way. Right, let's head this way then and go straight down. I'm satisfied I haven't missed anything. Now we're going to head off and keep going towards the town. Which, if I remember correctly, is going to be the reverse way of the way we came up this way. Which is going to be straight on through this next bit here and then take a left. Because we came in straight ahead, didn't we? So if we go this way, let's check behind this tree first. 
Right. Location G5. Like the old Power Max. What? Yep, yeah, nerd. Um, let's go this way. Again, always got to be looking for G4. Where are we in G4? So G4, we are G4. Yeah, there we are. We're heading into the town. Perfect. Just going to do a cursory glance at everything. And let's head this way. Can I get on top of there? No. Okay, let's not head that way. Let's head this way, north. And let's see what we've got. I'm going to save it next opportunity I get, which is going to be here. Because it's been a while since I've saved it and we've we've managed to get through that, uh, that maze. So... Let's let's go this way. Cool. Oh, oh. I ask everybody that's watching this to remember this is still in beta, so this does not reflect the finished game. What's in that? Can I interact with that? Public phone. Let's check it out. Call a taxi to take you home. Oh no! Oh, I can get a pizza. Yeah, I want pizza. You'll be our last customer before we close up, and the pizza will be a great run. We really make it back. Pizza! Yeah, man, love pizza. Um, oh, palm trees. Can I? I can't mine those. Okay, where am I? Ed and Edna's healthcare. Oh yeah, come on. We're going in. I want to meet Ed and Ed and Edna. Ah, oh, there's Edna. Hey, Edna. You all right? I am soon done here. Clear <laughs> bulging eye. <laughs> My patients are just fine. They're just taking their taking their clothes off right now. Okay. Okay. Well, Edna's lost it. Let's get some energizer. Nothing in there. Nothing all around here. Oh! Zombie, 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 and I don't have a chicken. That's ne I never thought I would say put those two things together. Ooh! Is this stuff to take? Yes. What's in there? Can I interact with the deadness in there? Nope. Okay, I'm going to interact with that. Oh, no! Ed and Edna's healthcare doesn't seem to be sort of very healthy, right? There we go. Let's just get some more health on the go. Come on. Oh no, shattered. Oh god. I don't have another one. Have I got any? Oh, I do, don't I? I, I have my um, spiked clubs. Yeah, man. Have it. Eat it. Eat it. There you go. I'm liking that every single time that you um, dispatch a golden key. Oh, okay, I'll take it back, Ed and Edna's Healthcare. You're clearly doing a, a great service for your uh, your patients there. So I'm going to... Uh, I'm just going to leave now. And there's a bathroom. That's brilliant. When you eat the chili dog, you need to come to Ed and Edna's healthcare and not do what I did and wait and then shit your pants because you die. So you you want to go to Ed and Edna's from outer space and straight back into the mid 80s. 80s with a twist. Yeah, man. Right. There's a beach over there, isn't there? Let's go to the beach. I don't know about you, but... Emerald Harbour District. Ooh, hang on, what's behind here? Nothing there. Oh, I wonder if that used the gold coin, the gold uh, key. Oh, 
Oh, okay, I just took a poster. Can I... No, I was wondering if I could sort of take anything from the... If I could take anything from the, um, the computer. Because I needed to make... In order to make the cassette player so I could hear all the, the great bands in this game, I had to... Um, I have to have a, 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 a modem, don't I? And I just wondered if I could get one out of the computer there, but it didn't seem as if I could. Let's, uh, let's keep going. Who's that crazy cat? Or duck, or seagull. I know I can swim, because we have swum, right? We did that challenge a little while ago with that crazy guy. Um, no, there's nothing you to collect. Can I dive in the sea? Oh, I can, I can, I can run on the sea. Oh, not very far though. Okay, fine. Oh, this is a new place. I've come to a new area. That's sneaky, but I like it. Let's have a little look and see what we've got going on here. Can't get in. Okay, fine. What's that? Blob Schwans? <laughs> Oh, loving the art style, loving the names. Can I go through the mailboxes? Yeah, only postman should touch it, but I mean, you know, it's a game, right? You can too. So what we got going on over here? Surfers Hangout. No, can't get in. Guessing we're going to have to find another key. Like you can interact with things. Reminds me of Duke Nukem 3D where you can interact with different things in that game as well. Not just buttons to open open areas, but you can interact with projectors, you can interact with walls, you can interact with with doors and things. And it really made a hell of a difference when you played it. Ooh, what's that? I found some tokens for an arcade machine. Sweet. Now I'm stuck. <laughs> Let's uh, try and see if I can get out of here. Oh, I can. There we go. Cool. Right. Oh, can I bust open that trash? No. I wondered if I could with my gigantic spiked club. Right. Where are we? We are the youth of the nation. Oh, uh, GM13. G to M, 1 to 3. So we are in this area here. So North, North, North of Beach. Okay, let's go to the old town, which I'm guessing is down here. God, there's so much to explore. Even though I'm running through it quite quick, I think you've got to take your time and go through everything properly. So NTU, 30, NTU was it 1 to 3? So NTU, 1 to 3. So we're in this gigantic block here. Okay. First of all, anything to collect. Let's have a quick little look. Shopping carts. Ooh, car. Can't interact with the car. We have over 10 parking spaces. Very nice. Oh, look at this. Closed. Break the door. Oh, yes. Let's day of the dead, this. Dawn of the dead. Brilliant. Bri Is that a hi-fi? Yes! Ooh, okay. Yeah, you can just lift loads of stuff. I mean, uh, you know, borrow it and then you can give it back later. As I picked up a hi-fi, can I play some tapes? Let's save our game. Item. Oh, I have got a pizza. Sweet. Hi-Fi stereo. Ah, it's from my house, look. Same as the VCR gaming posters, all from my house. Sweet. Right, I don't think there's anything else to see. Oh, I can't. There you go.
Brilliant. Not since Duke Nukem. A mirror could be useful. Yeah, take that with you, mate. You do need a mirror. But I'm not going to tell any of you what for. Just yet. That's cool. That's very cool. What's this way? I like that there are enemies. I like the enemies are quite difficult to kill. I like that you've got to sort of really try and get your angle correct with the enemies. But what I like more about it is that they're not everywhere. You get that properly explore without having to worry about 300, 300 enemies just arriving and destroying you. And this is a mini maze again. The devs clearly like it, got a good maze. And why not? They're not utilised that well in games at all these days. Oh, more breaky stuff. Let's get some more resources. Oh, what? Man cave? Oh, yeah, please. Oh, suck me, suck me. Oh, brilliant. How do you find the secret hideout? Because it's gigantic, mate. You look like another cop. Should you look at my wares? I have ways of getting stuff. Oh, yeah, cool. All oh, right, yeah, so you're a... Uh... Right, okay. Red rocks. How many credits have I got? 3,290. Wow. Okay, let's take... Oh. Let's take 11 bombs. Modems. Yes. 21. Why, why 21? Poster. Metal. Guinea, guinea pig cage. Oh, yeah, he's got to have a house. Computer station. Dynamite. And I think I'm out of money. Sweet. Thanks, pal. Go now. All right, I'm going. Good God. Um, so we've got our mother modem. We've got... We need to get some more screws and stuff, I think. Um, so that we can build our cassette player. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. So we've got houses over here. I wonder if we can get inside and not ransack, but steal everybody else's possessions. <laughs> nope. It's a simple answer to that. No JD, no mate, not at all. Okay, fine. Anything around here? No. Okay. Great. What about in here? No. No. Can I get in the window? No. Okay. I was hoping, because we broke down the, the glass doorway, I was hoping we could do that here. So it doesn't look as if we can get in the houses. How weird would that be, though? Just go into someone's backyard and just take their trees. Right. Especially looking like Slouk. Do you know what? We take that as well. Is that a cracked window? No. Whoa! Those holes just creep up on you. <laughs> Anything this way? Right, let's ascertain where we are and where we're going to go. So we are NU13. So I re more the rear, I reckon we're here. Train station, I reckon, could be straight ahead of us, maybe. Let's have a look. So, let's keep going. Stone, gone. Harvested, num num num. Ooh. Loving these cars. Ooh. Soda. I need a little bit more health, don't I, really? So let's have... Let's eat a pizza. Oh, there we go. Full health. And I mean, exactly. That's exactly what a pizza would do to you. It would give you full health. I mean, that's what pizzas do to me, right? So... Oh! That's nice. Oh. Okay, let's go over there and investigate said crow. Hello, mate. You're saving my storage on my back. 
Okay, so now we've got a sickly crow. Great. <laughs> what are we going to do with said crow? Hopefully we can revive him. Hopefully we can bring him back to uh, to health. I can hear music. Can't interact with a car. Oh, hang on. Huh. Oh, look, there's a tape. Frog leg. Sweet. Okay. I didn't know you could push cars. Right. Okay. What's this? Is this an electric electric terminal? Get some more wood. Ooh, bomb. Nice. Okay, let's head this way. It's really good taking all this wood. I mean, not for the environment and stuff, but. Ooh. Because, oh, darkness. It doth fall. Add our little flashlight back to get as much stuff as we can. Because I know what's going to happen. I always go to build stuff in games and it's you don't have enough resources. So I'm trying to get loads of resources. There we go. And this one. Yeah, there we go. Right, let's keep heading this way. Choo choo station! I mean, yeah. Great. Let's go in. Let's have a little look. Okay, can't smash windows. I like that you you, you do think that way once you've played a lot of games. Can I smash through this way? Can I smash through this way? But I like the game has a, has a set way of going. Oh, what's. Oh, are you a zombie wrangler? You're still lingering around in this town. You haven't noticed the whole neighborhood having a lockdown. If you have friends and family, go to them now. I still have zombies to take care to take care of underground. I have friends and family just not here. I understand. That's why you need to go. At the western part of this town is the Emerald Harbour District. You can still make it there for the next evacuation shuttle. But 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 I don't have any more time for you. Go. Okay, fine. I could help you. Just saying. Okay, let's take all the supplies. Take all the supplies. More potato chips, more soda. Sweet. Can I interact with this? Yes, I can. For a great big 200 good ones. Sweet. What's that? This is the end of humanity. I mean, the zombies are really sweet. I really quite like them. <laughs> I think... I think they look quite sweet. Okay, let's head this way then. Oh, hang on, did I check out what's over here? I did, didn't I? Yeah, I did, I remember. Okay, let's head this way. Let's keep going. Where are we going to go now? Location NU13. Okay, did I? I don't think I came this way, did I, before? And there's a giant pizza. Mmm, pizza! Damn right. Okay. Can I interact with these houses? No? Okay. Empty shell of a house. Nothing behind it. Next one, another empty shell. Maybe this is a neighbourhood that's either just coming up or has been destroyed. 200 credits. Sweet. Nothing behind it. Nothing down there. No. Okay. I just checked behind this one too because I didn't. Cool. Nothing there. Oh, was that a shadow? Yeah, it was. I thought something was walking there then. Oh. What's in there? That's weird. I wonder if I can get into any of these. 
No. 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 We tr oh, we didn't try that one. No. Okay. What's over here? Can't get in there. Okay. That is fine. Oh, there's more here. There's loads more here. Oh, 200 credits. Don't mind if I do. What's over here? Oh, is this the back of... No, it looks like a different place. I thought that was the back of the place I was just at. Maybe it is. Maybe I'm just looking at it from a different angle. It doesn't make sense. Oh, what's down there? I bet you that's still part of the underground system, the train station. Can't get under there. That would be a nice DLC for this game. Unlock the whole of the train station. Diving board. Can I use the diving board? Oh, I can jump over it. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, 200 credits again. Very nice. Okay. Now where? Oh, we're back to the car park. Okay, well, I think that's the way I came in, wasn't it? So we're back at the car park, which is here. Okay, so there's the scrapyard, there's Frank's home. There's Amica Woods, there's House Alfredo. Never been to House Alfredo. There's the old castle. There's the scrapyard. Oh, God, there's still so many places that we've not been. Okay, let's head west and see where we, where we end up. Is it back the way we came or is it somewhere new? Oh no, this is, this is where we were isn't it, yeah, okay, I'm going to run through here, is there anything I've missed, no, nothing in here, no, Nothing there. What's this way? Little bus. Oh no, there's, that's where I ordered my pizza from, wasn't it? There's Ed and Edna's. Oh, good old Ed and Edna's. Don't need my flashlight right now. Let's just turn that off. Oh no, that. Oh, yeah, I ordered my pizza from some from one of them. This is the harbour. So let's head to the harbour. It's kind of going in the opposite direction I want to go, but quite honestly, I'm having so much fun just exploring. Okay, can I interact with... It's locked. Okay. I can't interact with those. Okay, fine. More credits over there. I thought I saw something glistening. I need a, it has a red key symbol. Okay. <laughs> Morning has broken. It's locked and no keyhole. So the middle one is the red keyhole. Let's go behind this truck. The red truck doesn't seem to be behind the gate for some reason. Because the red truck is an awesome truck because it has a pizza. I don't mind if I do. Thank you much. Let's keep going. Can I get in the back? No. Let's run down this side. Interact with the doors? No. Okay. Now let's see where we're headed. Great big crane with a pizza in the middle of it. Amazing. Interact with that? No. That's a, an oil spill it looks like. Oh, two buttons. Whoa, what the hell? Okay, so you can't go in the water. Two buttons in there on the wall, look. 
I can't. Oh, I can. Brilliant. First of all, what's that? I really don't know what this is for. And the same as this one, I guess. Okay, the consoles must be offline. Okay, let's try this. Turn crane 90 degrees. Oh, right, okay. Let's see first what we need to do. Whoa! Trippiness Maximus. Let's see if we can... Let's save our progress. Okay. Oh, okay, so I, I, I gotta move that. Have I gotta move that? Yeah, I think I gotta move that. Okay. So, which way? I gotta turn it right, didn't I? 90 degrees. Turn cream 90 degrees. If that's north east. Yeah, and then activate magnet. Oh, I'll go lower it first. Okay, fine. There you go. Sweet. More pizza. Okay, I can't go that way. I know it looks like a jumping puzzle, but I don't want to jump and die. Okay. Little tugboat down there. Little tugboat there. Everything else is cordoned off. So where do I go? Can I jump these? No. Oh, hang on. That's a tank. You came right... You came right on time to evacuate. How oh, kid... Is it, is it evacuate? Nah, the only way I'm leaving this place is by my own vehicle. I just need to collect all stuff to get up and run in. Affirmative. We will storm the OEC facility when our reinforcement arrives. Sadly, we've had to destroy lots of roads leading to the facility. It was the only way to stop the further deliveries into the lab. Sounds like Dr. F. Rogman is starting to become desperate. Affirmative. Okay. Can I jump in the tank? Please let me jump in the tank. I very much would like to jump in the tank. <laughs> okay, I can't get in there. No, okay. So, I think I missed the last bit. She said, There are still people to save. Get up on the tank, to fend off the zombie hordes. You can reach the tank's top by going from behind. Okay. Okay, that's a puzzle in itself, isn't it? So I've got to get behind the tank, which means if I'm AF13, AF13 Emerald there, I'm here. Okay. Did I check this door? Yeah, okay. So it's just a red key. And I don't know where that red key is. So I'm going to try something and move in that 180 degrees and then dropping it. I don't know if I can, if I'm able to do that. Um, can I? No. Okay, I still can't move anything. Okay, fine. Yeah, I'm going to try that actually. I'm going to try moving that 100, 180 degrees and seeing what I get out of it. So if I can turn 90 degrees uh, west. Oh, okay, well, I can't. Okay, it just drops that. Fine. Okay, fine. So let's turn it. 
East. There we go. Well, it does look as if there was a little jumping game here. But I see so jump on those little pads uh, on the boxes. But I don't think that's going to work. Okay, let's go back to where we were. Let's save it first so that if anything happens, we've got a, an up to date version of what we're trying to do. So I've got to find a red key. I haven't got a red key, I reckon. I've got to leave the harbour, go into the town. I'm probably going to find some stuff there and then come back to the harbour. Oh, wrong button. Oh, wrong button again. No, okay. So let's head back into the town. I think there was, I noticed there was a, a left turning. Okay. Let's head this way. Try and get to somewhere new that we haven't been to before. I want to get into the old town. We didn't come this way, did we? Location H4. South or east? Let's go east. Because I think that's the part that we haven't been to. There we go. Police station. Or home and housing, rather. Hello, dude. This is Big Ass's house, of, uh, house and home stuff. House, uh, house and home shop. Okay, so this is where I can collect furniture from and build up my home. Okay, fine. Has he got anything behind him? No, he hasn't. Okay. I'm going to go to the second floor. Let's give it a try. See what kind of stuff he's got going on here. Ooh. Lots of stuff. Nice. Very nice. Okay. Very nice. Living room, powder room, dining room, office. Okay, cool. That's really cool. I'll come back there in a bit, actually, when I've got a bit more credits. Um, I want to save my credits for as much as I possibly can so I can get me some weaponry. Nothing in here. Can I interact with the police car? Step back, police investigation ahead. If you see anything suspicious other than lots of people dress, dressing up to celebrate the living holiday, let us know. Nice costume, by the way. Thanks, man. I'm an alien. Right, where are we, where are we at now? Laundromat. Okay. Ooh, there's that little sound. I have nothing to cut with. No, but there's a chest there, mate. Found shotgun ammo. Sweet. Ooh. Potato chips. Potato chips. Do you think the game will be done loading soon? Can I borrow some components of the high-end computers? You sound like my oldest brother, Stephen. No, you can't. Game will be loading soon. Whichever, whatever answer I'm going to give, I'm going to give to him. He's going to have a go at me. Yeah, there you go. Okay, he's trying to run depths of insanity. Okay. Let's um, just wait. I don't think so, but I, I won't leave this place with all the crazy stuff going around. Okay. Some are dressing up as some are real monsters. Yeah, like me. Ooh. There we are. Potato chips. Oh, soda. Collect it all. Anything else in here? No, doesn't look like. Double check in. Nick the poster. Can I nick that poster as well? Yeah, I can. Sweet. Can I take these? <laughs> yeah. Just clearing up all the posters. 
We used to do that with uh, movies. We used to go to the, go to the cinema and um, posters would just be left at the end of the... when, when, the, when the film was, was over and done with. Posters would be just left, just outside. So we used to just come along and just take them. Alfredo's! What's in here then? Oh, Alfredo's Arcade! Oh, sweet! Pop in 50 credits. Let's give it a shot. Oh, no. Well, I bought a gaming PC, didn't I? From that guy's man cave. Okay, I got my credits back. Thanks, Alfredo. Oh, Alfredo. Oh, look, tip. Sin of hell. Sweet. Hello, Alfredo. So, Alfredo, I lost my job at the lab. Oh, bless him. I'm glad I have this arcade where I can, I can crash. Okay, so Slog is introducing himself. Come on, Slog, you know your name, mate. Slog, yeah. I crashed into the forest southeast of here. Do you know the name of this planet? Planet is planet, it's planet Tellus. You look like something mostly made out of goo. Can you change shapes? Ooh, oh, hang on, what? I can shapeshift. Oh, Alfredo. Brilliant. <laughs> so I can shapeshift when I was on Planet Horizon. Okay, cool. So now I can look like other people as well. Oh, that is brilliant. Okay, now what? All movie experience. Oh, okay. So when I took the mirror. Sweet. Okay. So I, I've got to go to his house in U4. In U okay, fine. I can do that for you, mate. What I'll do is I'll stay dressed up as Alfredo, so hopefully his wife will let me in. And, uh... Oh, I mean, Alfredo, mate, come on. Have a bit of decency with you. There you go. Okay, so I've got to go to Alfredo's house. Okay, starting up the notepad. Go to... Alps. Oh. Yeah, I got a problem with my uh, my hitch key then. Go to his home. Okay, sweet. I've got a, a new map. Oh, three of a kind. Oh, three tokens. They're, they're the tokens that I, I found earlier. Okay, sweet. So three reds are 50 tokens, three greens are tokens by five, three blues energized times four, three whites are 500. Oh, I won 150 credits. Oh, I wonder if that's the, is that the key? No. Oh, that, that was pretty decent though. <laughs> it's a good bit of fun. And we got a new cassette. So I want to go to U4. That's his house, isn't it? So where are we now? K4. So U4. Oh yeah, there we go. House Alfredo. So... Where am I now? K4. There. Shopping district. So I just need to go basically in a straight line past Frank's home. Amiga ones. Amiga Woods. Oh, I wonder if that, even though it's spelt differently, I wonder if that's an, a paying homage to um, the Amiga computer. Okay, and then House Alfredo. So I guess I've got to keep on going east. So let's keep on going east. Wooden more. Oh yeah, I came here before. I can. You can buy that. But if you if you buy the, the stone, it takes you back to your home. And I don't have a way of teleporting quickly back to here, so I'm not gonna do that. But I am gonna buy a little shovel. Sweet. And I am gonna buy a scythe. No oh not enough. Okay, fine. Can I talk to you? We've got one twenty four seven. Ah nice. Okay, I can't really talk to him. But I can take that tape. Frostbit by love. Very sweet. We're clearing up around here. Can I get that way? No. No. Okay, I can't go that way. Can I take the wood? No. Okay. Thank you for your time. 
What about you, crazy man? What's your story? Henrik, Indy Force team. Do not cross these barricades. One of Dr. F. Rogman's trucks crashed into a wall ever since weird stuff started to happen around here. Okay, so eastward from here is not safe anymore. Well, sorry, pal, I'm going east because I need to go to uh, Alfredo's ex-wife's house. Okay, well, that's the truck that exploded. Guns and ammo. Let's have a little look around this place first. Ooh, 200 credits. Very cool. Oh, that's a weird zombie. Let's go and have a look at him in a minute. Let's see if we can get a gun. Oh, no, just ammo. Okay. Lots of shotgun shells. Ooh. The shotgun shells up there too, isn't it? Yeah. I wonder if I can... The shotgun shells in there. Can I break this down? It's behind glass. Yeah, but I've got a club, mate. Surely? No. Okay, fair enough. So, have I got to go right? Or can I fit down there? Oh, I can. Sweet. <laughs> Look at him, his little naked self. Sweet. He is done, and I've got more coins. Ooh. Shocking owl. I really want to find a shotgun soon, just so I can start being a bit of a menace. Okay, let's head this way. Keep it on going east, keep it on going to Alfredo's house. Ah, now, chilli sausages. I, I, you can talk to the guy all day long, don't eat that sausage, because you've got four minutes, four minutes, that's it, to find a toilet. I didn't find it. And I absolutely defecated myself and it was game over. So I'm not going to eat that. Not yet. I've got a quest to go to Alfredo's house. Oh, is this Frank's house? We just passed um, that, I, that we saw on the map. Go bother someone else waiting for my father. Yeah, there you go. So she's waiting for her dad, Frank. She helped me out with my car. Okay, I also know you like the quiet place over on M9. Hang on. M9 is my home. M9, yeah, look, M9 is my home. So what, what was he? Ah, oh, look at Alfredo. Uh, so he's there. He wasn't there when we were last there, was he? I didn't see him. There was nobody there, it was just me. Let's take the tape. Death as a family. Okay, we're going to keep pushing east. Because we've got to get to Alfredo's wife's house. So keep going east and it should be very shortly, hopefully. This is going to be uh, Amiga Woods. Yeah, there we go. Amiga Hoods. Let's get all these credits. Because I'm running low. Ooh, soda. I almost ran straight past that. That reminds me, I don't really have a lot of health. So let's, let's eat the pizza. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, I wonder if I can interact with the, the trunk of that car. Oh, that's the... No, can't interact with any of it. Okay, fine. Interact with the house? Ooh! Okay, I can knock the door. Well, you didn't answer the door, so I'm going to take you a treat. Can I interact with this car? No. Okay. Interact with this car. No. Ooh. More credits. Okay. No one there. Is that somebody's tree? Yeah. No. Can't take it. Okay. Fine. Interact with the car. No. Got to try these things. Oh, hang on. There was credits in that back garden. Just saw them as I walked around the house. As I walked under here, I could see them for that gap. Oh, look at that. Couldn't buy one, because I didn't have enough credits. But luckily, there was one right there. 
more credits. Can't go that way, so around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. No one home. Okay. I can take the trees, though, can't I? There we go, got those. Can't interact with the car. Credits. How many credits have I got now? 1600. It's locked. Okay. It's a shame I didn't have a key. Not that I could have, you know, not that I can go and go into other people's houses if they're not there, if you've got a key. But I could have gone into somebody else's house if I had a key. Oh, look at this. This is a good sign. Bloodstains in the forest. Ooh, look, a ladder. I wonder if I can get in that house. See if I can get into this house. I'm not home, go away. I wonder if I can keep on knocking it and whether they will answer. No, it's not a repetition thing. Okay, I didn't know if I was to keep on doing it that eventually the person on the other end. Remember, like in the old games, if you keep on doing things like 10 times, somebody might answer the door or a phone would ring or something like that. No, okay, that's not going to happen. Thought I'd give it a try. So now the next should be Alfredo's house. Yeah, there you go. Certainly looks like Alfredo's house. And I'm basing that on absolutely nothing. That sounds like a band that I know quite well, I think. He was a cancel. That's jam steak. That is jam steak. Whoa! Get out of my way, woman. Right. So I've got Alfredo's game console that he wanted. I'm going to take jam steak. Jam steak, come with me. Jam steak, come with me. Get out of this crazy house. Jam steak, I saved you. Ah! <laughs> now you're stuck in there. Okay, I'm going to go back in your house. Did I get jam steak? I got jam steak. Good. Can I take that with me? No? Okay. Anything around here? No. No. Do you know what though? What's in there? Hang on. More to the point. What's in here? Who goes there? Ooh, okay. Okay, cool. So his wife is now stuck in a pit. So technically, he could go home, couldn't he? If he doesn't, you know, want to rescue his wife from the pit, I guess. Right, so we saved Jam Steak. We've got a load of other tapes. We've got the ability to, uh, with a few more screws, create the uh, the tape player so we can start listening to some in-game music we've done Alfredo's little task for him and I've gone the wrong way again haven't I there we go, I'll go back this way and then it should just be yeah there we go yeah there we go sorry still haven't seen Frank let's keep on going west now back to Alfredo's place and then give him his little Game Boy or Game Boy esque thing. Let's keep going. It should be down here, shouldn't it? Oh no, not this one, the next one, right? Here we go. Keep going, keep going, keep going. And it should be down here. Yeah, there you go. There you are, my friend. Hello. There we go. Nice. There we go, Alfredo. All yours, my friend. Thank you very much. Is that him now? Is he, has he disappeared? Head to the eastern part, V10, the lab's outside. There's a secret way in. Ooh! Oh, I've levelled up. Excellent. What do I get now? 
I've got, as a check in, I've got more HP, 5% or 5 plus 5 HP, and another second chance orb. They're great, they are. I really like those. And I really like there's something like that in the game as well. There we are. Perfect. Can I jump over there? No, damn it. Mirror. I want to stay as Alfredo for a second. So we came that way originally. Then we went that way to complete the quest. Let's go this way. Let's see what we've got. Let's 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 keep. Ah oh, no, not football. Football sucks. <clears throat> okay, let's um, let's see what this dude wants. Hey, stop walking away. Want to play some soccer? Not really, mate. No. Okay, so I've got to score against against him, I guess. There we go. Fifty credits. Game on. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, I love his shades. There we go. Can I... Oh, Alfredo's watching me. Can I beat him up? No, I can't. No! There we go. No! 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 Oh, what? Me, come on. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Have it. Eat it. There we are, again. Mate, you're an awful goalkeeper, and this is coming from somebody who actually detests football. No! 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 On goal! Oh, what? Three, two, one. Time's up. Hey, yeah, it's okay. One game token. Hey, do you know what? That's not bad. Can I kill you? No. Okay. It's cool that Alfredo was watching me from over there as well. Right, let's uh, continue to uh, look around the place then and see what we've got. That was actually quite fun. For my belly aching about football. That is, uh, that was quite a fun element. It's low. Ah, oh, no wrong way. Back this way first. Loads of different elements to this game. Guaranteed. You're going to have hours upon hours upon hours of fun with this. So. Let's see. Is there anything else around here? How the hell did I miss those two? Watch your profanity. Nice. Oh, this is the festival. Sweet, okay, let's apply. Contestants are Kenny as a turd, Blob Schwantz as a lizard, where's he this year? And a snail person. Oh, that's me then. Name is Slough, right? Really Very nice costume, haven't seen this year. First prize goes to. Yay, it goes to me! Sweet. A thousand credits. Excellent. Let's keep going. Let's go this way. Interwebs Cafe, we've been there, haven't we? So let's go back there and let's go down. Oh, there's a tip there. There's a tip right there. Look. Who's this? Can't break me down. Oh, can I go on the swing? I can. <laughs> can I go down the slide? Oh, no. <laughs> Merry go round. Oh, oh, a bit dizzy. Oh, that's trippy. <laughs> oh, that is so trippy. Oh, it's a chest there, look. 150 credits. 
What's this way? Oh, the police station. Okay, fine. Go back this way then. Where are we going now? Uh, we came in that way, didn't we? So then we go back out this way. Oh, car park. Nice. Can I interact with these cars? No. Okay. Ooh. A gold mineral. I can sell it and maybe use find some use for it later on. Sweet. Very nice. Okay. Now where are we going? Oh, zombie and a tape. Go on, zombie. Have it. Take it, son. Good. What's this? Red eyes. Militia! Amazing. Can I interact with these cars? i got to get that tape player made. So I think what we do... Let's have a look and see what we've got. Have I got enough screws and stuff? Where can I find that item? Look at all these music. Sin of Hell. We've got Supervision. We've got Militia. We've got us death pigeon hunting and tortured we've got to hell and back we've got raise raise cane we've got thunder sleep we've got lifting curses we've got jam steak we've got so many we've got so many <laughs> right okay what do we got soda vcr metal telephone second chain job we've got second chance on we've got three of those great key item uh what am i looking for is the um, nuts and bolts we've got six right okay then let's head let's head back to our little uh, our little home and then see if we can build it so where am I H H4 so I've got to get down to M9 I'm like so H4 is there and we've got to get down to there M9 so I can go parking Okay, we can keep on going south. Keep on going south. East. South. We just come from there. So let's go west. I wonder if we can go west to then go south. You know what I mean? So if we go out on ourselves. Because we can't go south from the car park. Because there's a great big wall in the way. So let's go back to M9 anyway. And then at least from there we can see where we've got to go. Now we're in G4. Not to be confused with... Not that it would be, actually. I'm just thinking about it. No, that's just stupid. Not to be confused with... Uh, the old power PC CPU is using, Mac, using Apple Macs. Yeah, shop John. Yeah, all right. All right, dude. Yes, there I go. So let's keep going. Where are we going to go now? Could be loading or oh, G. Oh, there we are. G to M. We're at the beach. We're going totally in the wrong direction. Let's keep going this way. What's over here? Nothing. Okay. Let's go this way. Let's keep going. Let's just keep going south for now. Until we can't go south any longer. Gas station. This way. Oh, hang on. Did I pick up... Yeah, that's the right way to go. That's the right way to go. Did I pick up the chicken? No! Come on, son. Yeah, thank you, mate. Right, got a new chicken. Let's keep going. Now we're getting down to the waterfall again by the water. There's the old chest that we opened. Let's go in this way. We're heading to M9, folks. Ooh. Ooh. What's this? Before I go down that little road. What's this? Okay. Okay. Right. Let's head into here. Abandoned mining site. Oh, I mean, because everything good that's ever happened ever in horror stories has always been because of abandoned mining sites, right? Oh! <laughs> yeah. 
What the hell? Oh my god, well that doesn't sound good. Immediately. Oh, I'm gonna crash! Yeah, good idea. Where did it go? Good question, rather. I dropped my dynamites and they'd be scary. I better go back and retrieve them. Okay. I know we didn't go that way, but... Ooh! Depoisy! Okay, I haven't got any more dynamite. Oh, of course, because I dropped them, didn't I? Ugh. Is that green goo on the floor back there? Okay, I better have one of these little depoisy things. Um, in case. Makes foul poison go away. Well, before I get poisoned, let's get a bit of immunity to it. What the hell is that? That's a gigantic ant. That's a radioactive ant is what that is. Oh, right, okay, so it's communicating with us. It says frog murdered my whole tribe. Oh, no. I really want to do for that frog. And I, 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 do, I do like frogs, but not this guy. Okay, I need to get, get inside the lab, helping this creature. Okay, and then frogman needs, needs to get his come up and Oh, look, I've got a red key in the brain. Red key and brain. Ba 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 brain. There we go. Oh. There we go. Sweet. Red key card found. Brain found. Nice. Oh, I just noticed something. My little hamster dude is dead. The little hamster guinea pig dude that I bought that... Uh, I paid all that money for that home for him as well. His little cage. And he's not here to enjoy it. Oh, I got a chicken though. Pretty sure they're uh, pretty much the same animal, right? No. Okay. Ah, there's the dynamite. Now let's go back and blow the hell out of that great big red stone at the bottom. Someone's telling me I shouldn't. Someone's telling me I should get out of the abandoned mine. But I'm not going to listen to myself, because I'm an idiot. So, let's get rid of that, um, not, not there, this one. Yeah, this one. Let's blow up this. Right, let's get ready for whatever the hell is behind you. What in the hell? Okay. Okay, there's a tip there, but I am most certainly going to be saving this beforehand because this has got death written all over it. Right, okay. Barracoded. Okay, tip acquired. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, wrong one. If I come back one, there we go, and I can jump onto that. Sweet. Is that a chest over there? It is. Oh, look at that. That takes some. That takes takes some working out. A little puzzle like that. Really, really cool. Really like that. Really like that. Right, let's keep going. What the hell is this place? Oh, is it a car park? Is it something that's... It looks like a really futuristic battle base or something. What's a battle base? Um, F. Rogman. Ooh. It is that horrible person's... Or that horrible frog's car. This game looks fun. Yeah, let's try 50 credits again. Oh, I haven't gotten all three to though, if I had to give me the money back. Ah, there we go. Well, you take your chance, you, you know, lose. 
This looks like it could be Ephrogman's base. Yeah, that's going to tear me apart, those lasers are. Okay, so I found Ephrogman's base. That's still making a noise. Is it expecting me to interact with it? Yes, Mother Modem. Nice. Okay, cool. So that was. So I could have interacted with the other one I broke as well a little while ago. Um, now what? I've come that way, haven't I? So let's let's keep going. Oh, I'm back to. Okay, I've gone so far off piste. That's back to Frank. So I need to keep going back the way I came, which means going back and jump in all those little things again. Oh, hello. Who are you? Alice, travelling merchant. I collect things in between my job and sell them at the top. Okay. Let's make business. So let's, let's buy. What have you got? Wood, stone, chunks, nuts and bolts. Food, nuts and bolts. I want to make sure I've got enough to build that um, a tape player. Rusty sword, I think. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have a rusty sword. That's all I want for the second. Thank you very much. Perfect, thank you. Right, let's head back. Hockey. Oh, this is nice. What's it say? Four trees named after four famous kings. Gustavo II, Carl, Carl Gustav Adolf and Don Bluth. <laughs> Don Bluth, he was a gangster, wasn't he? Was he or am I thinking of the wrong thing? Hmm. There's nothing here to collect. No zombies, no ammo. Next. M5. Perfect. So I need to get to M9. Nothing to go on there. So I can't go south because there's a wall there, but I can go west. Which I don't think is the desired... Oh, tape. Don't think it's the desired place I want to go to. Marked with a bullet. Still need someone to play it on. Yeah, I need a music device. That's why I need to go back to M9 to get the music device built. Got so much to see and do in this game. Really genuinely impressive. Right, okay. I'm back at soccer. Okay, back. And then... I guess I'm going to have to... Hmm. Let's go back the way I, way I came. Because that was M... M5... So M5 is M5 is there. So I can't go that way because there's a wall there. But I can go around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. And I can go that way. Okay. So let's see if I can go this way. Um, let me consider this. So I'm here gas station. Well, I can, can't I? I can go that way. I can go that way. I can. It's just a little bit longer. Oh, no need. I can go that way. Perfect. And then right, I'm back to here now, aren't I? So then I can go this way. Back to where I was with soccer. Okay, yeah. No, we're not playing, mate. No, 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 no. I've already won against you. Yes, okay. I only scored one point but winning's winning right keep going where am I heading now I think see I'm, I'm so close but at the same time so lost <laughs> yeah and then if I go this way and then H4 I'm just heading back into town now aren't I G4 G5, 
if I just keep on heading this way, if I get down to 10, 6 gas station, right, I know where I am. Well, sort of. This is down by the root of the waterfall, isn't it? Yeah, let's go this way. This will take me to the waterfall. Which will then take me back to... Yeah, there you go. Waterfall. Which will take me back to... Here. There we go. Here we go. Right. Can I blow that up? I can. Let's, um... Turn the flashlight on first. Okay, got a shovel. Perfect. Oh, another one. Whoa. No, saw that. Big booby bats not going down there. Not going down there. There are zombies in here in the, in the woodlands. Oh, there we go. This way, please. Hey, look, it's Kenny. Watch your profanity. Sorry, man. Name's Kenny. Okay, you know what? I did it, and I will most likely do it again. All right, dude. What are you talking about? I've lost 99 of my closest friends. They look like this little fella here. Not to be rude, but aren't they like giant turds? Turd is the word, if you find them. Okay, cool. So he wants me to find 99 of his friends. Okay, cool. 5,000 credits if I return them all to him. Cool. Let's do it. <laughs> There's one. Sweet. Okay. I should be quite close to... I should be quite close to uh, the home now. Oh, who's this dude? <laughs> Who are you and what are you? I've lost a big amount of my memory when I got here. Are oh, you the one crashing in front of my house while taking the shit? The technology in the spacecraft looks different than ours. If you give me materials and a contract to rebuild my house, then we can be done with each other. I need 30 wood, 40 stones, 10 nuts and bolts. Okay. I can hear a chicken. Okay, so I need to, get, I need to get, give him supplies. But I'm not going to give him supplies yet. I'm going to give him supplies later. Let's keep going this way. Back to my spacecraft. So now... Where am I now? I know where I am. I'm spacecraft there, so I need to go across and over, don't I? Which I think is this way. I think. Is it? And then is it that way? I think it might be. Yes! Perfect, we're back. Okay, let's see if we can make the if we can make the music player. Absolutely. Fantastic. So, let's get some music on the go. Let's get some music on the go. So how do I use it? So let me guess. First of all, let's save. And then, let's go night item. Key item. No. Nope. Item. Uh, I can't click on it. Okay. Do I access it from this menu? No items. I'll move from here then. Yeah, Walkman. Use Walkman. Which of the tips should I like to play? Play Buffett by Kenny Crossley. To Hell and Back by Florian Rocks. Sin of Hell by Florian Rocks. Can't Break Me Down by Raise Kane. I Hate, I hate by Raise Kane. With, with a Bullet by Raise Kane, Enough by Raise Kane, Frog Leg by Superposition, Circus Recipe by Anger Overdose, 
Frostbit by Love by Thundersleet, Red Eyes by Militia, Death as My Family by Lifting Cor- Corpses, Sadness into Mas- Madness by Death Pigeon, Hunted and Tortured by Death Pigeon, Humans Are Cancelled by Jamstick, Barracoded by Talwal, Play Talwal by Talwal, Play Ego by Pray, Villains, Pray for Villains, Play Engines by Sparrowlin, and then I got more to find as well. So let's start off as we mean to go on. Anger Overdose, I don't have that song. Okay, fine, and I'm not listening to that one then, am I? Then let's, let's try again. Let's try again. Walkman. I know, I know which one. I know which one that I've got. I know. Let's start with Red Eyes. Yeah! Perfect. There you go. And you can find all of Militia's information in the description, same as every other band in this video. Okay, so now, where do we need to go from this area now? We need to go to... There was a cemetery, wasn't there? Around here. Right, let's go to the cinema. Uh, the cinema? Uh, cemetery. Oh no, I won't need to build something first. No. Cemetery, please. Which I think is up here. Shovel that through. Oh! Right. <laughs> Don't know why I was surprised that there were corpses in the cemetery. What do we say here? Work paused and outbreak taking care of the inside of the, of the uh, Adrum Drum Dungeon. Continuation from the pit of Mother Resume shortly. Okay. Password protected. I haven't come across a password. Okay. We're on the hunt for a password. First of all, let's go down and kick some ass. It's all gonna help. Oh, it's a green one. Right. Come on. One down. Health still looking pretty decent. Oh, gone. Five energizers. Sweet. Right. What's over there? Oh, it's one of um, Kenny's friends. Sweet. Five energizers. Right, okay. Let's continue this way. Is there a way that way? No. Then let's continue this way. Turn the light off first though. Sweet! Where to now? Ooh. <laughs> Can I? Oh my god, they're biting me from down there. You want me? Can I use my chicken? I can. 
and it's quite fun. some tunes. I think I picked up Sin of Hell. Did I pick up Sin of Hell? I oh, do you know what? Do you know what? Where is it? Let's get some jam steak. Lovely to hear militia. Now let's get some jam steak on the go. It's a cave there. Lovely. Replenish all my health. Oh, wow! Brilliant. Right, the fire there. We're going to pass through that in a minute. Well, for the second, we're going to go in that cave. Flashlight function will really be helpful in here. Yeah, right. Okay, well, the booby bats don't. The chicken doesn't work with my booby bats. And I never thought I'd ever say that. Let's run past them, sod it. Come on, Kenny's friend. Cool. Pick up all this iron. Run, 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 run. Get out of my way. Come on now. Ooh, rusty sword. Right, there's lots of way to die here. Let's save it because I'm guaranteed I'm going to die. Oh, yeah, what the hell? Okay. Oh, good God. See, that almost died. I'm a nightmare. Right, come on, let's go. Let's get through this. Get through that. Get through that. No, go away, dude. Oh, that was where I broke from before, wasn't it? Oh, no, this is different. Ooh. Ooh, it's iron. It's got to be guarded by something quite disgustingly big, isn't it? Hey, look at that! That little dude. Well, I can't. I can't sort of take him with me. It's a shame. What well, to um, jumpstick? Let's rectify this situation. By my, my, by, by my house too. Amazing. My house is in there. Okay, let's not go too far. Let's go back in the cave. Oh, it changes. Okay. Okay. Let's. Um. I think I. I think I did get to hell and back. You know, sin of hell. I did.
Thank you, Patiel. Thanks, guys. Oh, I fell! No! I know dying is bad for your health, but I didn't really... Oh, good. Second chance orb. Brilliant. I thought I was standing on the platform. Oh, no, where am I? What? Are oh, you joking? Where am I? I <laughs> What's happened? Have I just... Have I just respawned in a black hole? I think I have. I think I have respawned in an absolute black hole. Okay, let's see if I can load that, that, that game up then. I can save. I can't... If I go to save... No, I can't. Okay. Where am I? Can I use a second chance orb again and sort of orb myself out of wherever the hell I am? Oh no, I don't have any. Don't I? No, I don't have any, look. Oh, I do, I have one. I can't use it. Okay, let's see if I can walk off wherever it is I am. No. Yeah, there you go. Now, second chance me back to another place. Oh, I say I fell into internal. Ah, it, 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 oh, it's over. No, God, it was so good. I'm going to have to reload that save game. I'm going to have to reload that save game. I don't know where, where I was. 157. Oh, that's quite a, way, quite a way ago, isn't it? Oh, no, it wasn't. It was there. Perfect. Perfect. That's exactly where I wanted to be. Because that's exactly where I was. Okay. I think I went through there, didn't I? I picked up Kenny's friend and I went through here and then mined all the iron. So let's do that again. But let's do that to the song that we were currently listening to when I decided to fall to my death. So, let's do some... It was Sin of Hell, wasn't it? By Florian Rocks. Yeah, it was. Be sweet. Fifty credits. Cool. Now let's go back through this little secret area that we found. And then I think down there is my house, isn't it? Yeah. So up here would be... Yeah, there we go. Cemetery. We went into the cave. I'm not going to go any further into the cave for a minute. Let's go this way. Sweet. Ooh, big. Okay, four cars open. Didn't expect that to open. Oh, yes, mate. Yes. Oh, now we're talking. Now we're talking. More credits. Perfect. 
I'm not gonna I'm not gonna harvest any more wood for the minute. We might go back to where that portcullis is in a moment. Oh, that's where we were earlier. Kenny's friend. Sweet. I'm not gonna go that way. We went that way, we got a tape from there, didn't we? Let's go this way. Portcullis into the castle. Where are we off? Oh, there's a skeleton on fire. Okay. Hurt him with light. That's some good info. I'll let the, the notes stay there if I happen to be as unfortunate with him. Let's try and remember the password at least. Could be useful later on. Hurt him with light. Light up every light source you find in here. Make him fall into the vortexes of light. Weapons won't hurt him. The moon blade can push him further. Oh Jesus Christ, this is our song. Yeah. This is hunted and tortured. No, it's not. This is uh, sadness and into madness. Don't even know my own song. With my last breath, take this password. Glittering prizes. Okay. So let's save it because if we die, then we can load it back up from here. And then at least... Can I take him? Yeah, okay. Okay, can't jump. Can I jump over that? I'm going to try it. Yes, I can. Kenny's friend. Thank you, man. So, ooh, chest. Found a ruby. Amazing. Light up all the lights. Send him into the light. Oh, God, what is he? What is he? What is he? Dungeon key. Epic. Um, back one. Jump. 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 Yeah. Oof. Parts of my mouth doing those. Bloodstone. Energizers. Where is it? What is he? Ooh, what's that? That's a torch. I could probably ignite a flame here using a torch. Have I got a torch? I got ignite. Yes, I do. Sweet. Sweet. Right, I get what I gotta do. Took me a while. <laughs> we get there. This way? No. That way? Oh no. Okay. I've got a feeling they might have to come back for that chest, but for the minute I'm not going to bother. Okay, this way. Oh god, with the eyes? No. <laughs> All right, calm down, John, calm down. No idea what the hell is waiting for me here. I've never been in here before. All right, okay, that's definitely something that uh, doesn't look obvious, uh, ominous at all. Let's, uh, oh. 
I got a dungeon key. Perfect. I don't have the right key. Okay. Oh god, is it going to be in that place where um, I didn't jump over? Probably is, isn't it? Let's be honest. Oh. Um, been that way. Is that the only way? Yeah, okay. Let's go back. And then let's... Where was it? Was it this way? No. It was that way? Yes. And then that way. Yes. Okay. Jump. Hmm. I gotta go that way to come around. No. Interesting. <laughs> I can jump there, but I can't jump there because otherwise I'll die. And I can't. I can jump there though, can't I? Yes. Oh, pizza. Okay. Nothing inside. Great. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Wait. No! Why did I do that? A second chance? No. Fell into eternal darkness. But I can continue with my save game. Let's. Where did, where did I save it? Oh, even before I. Uh, right, okay. Let's take the torch. Let's equip the torch. Let's use what we what we know now. Let's equip the torch. Let's go and figure this out first, because I'm guarantee I can guarantee there's going to be inside there. There's going to be a key or something that I need. I know there is. Oh. Okay, got a ruby. Jump. Oh. I'm literally killing myself there. Okay. Let's go this way. Torch. Ignite. Teleporter? Okay, so I can teleport from one into the other. Fine. Key? No, Ruby. Okay. Can't get out of that, but I can teleport back. I thought I couldn't then for a minute. Okay, so I've got that. Now what do I do? Gotta find that. Oh, look at that. Interesting. Bloodstone. Jump. No! Oh, see? Clever. Jump. No. <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, that's it. And then run back. And then... Did I come this way? That's where I started off, didn't I? This way. No torches. No torches. No torches. No torches. Ooh, big room. Bloodstone. Two energizers. I really feel as if it's building me up for something. Okay. Torch. Sweet. What's in there? Dungeon key. Okay, great. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, right. No more t torches in here? No. Okay. Right. Sweet. So we've got... How many torches? Four? Four torches? I think we've got four torches. Um, sweet. More torches. Ooh. Ruby. So I know the dungeon key will allow us into the bottom part of the dungeon because we walked in there before I decided to jump to my death. Um, this is where we just were, wasn't it? Yeah, that's where we just were. Right, okay. Back. Right. Left. Ooh. Oh, okay. Just... Oh, Kenny's friend. Right, okay. So... I think we are doing quite well. Down here, isn't it? Where I use the key, I think. Yeah, I think it was this door. And I didn't have the right key for this door. Yeah, okay. So we're back where we were. Torch. What would be nice is a little counter. I don't know how many torches you've ignited along your way. I guess when you've when you've achieved it, you've achieved it, right? So I think that key that I'm after that I did not really get into that other cell is no not that way is in that box I can't get I can't get out right open that one set fire to that one this is the way we went earlier isn't it and this is the way yeah that's done is that a dead end? Yeah, okay. <laughs> so we've done all that. That's ignited. Open that box. Go back to the beginning now. Which I think is this way. Yes. In there. Yeah. I'm going to unequip that torch for now. I'm going to save. I'm going to unequip that torch while I figure out, because that's flickering in the corner of my of my eye. So if I jump once, I can jump to there, but I can't get anywhere else. I can get there, and then I can get there, get there. But I'm back now to be in, oh hang on. Oh, dungeon key, see? That's how that's done. <laughs> like as if I knew. <laughs> what? Um, that way, shoot, that way. Right. way. Right, okay. Nothing inside that one. Cheers, man. Right, okay, and that was a pizza down there, wasn't it? I don't, in this instance, I don't care too hell about that. fudged it. <laughs> okay, let's try again. Let's go that way. Let's go back to there. Let's go back to there, which leads me to there, which leads me to there, to there. My God. Right. Whoo. Now which way? Back the way I came. This way. Oh, spikes. And then, is it that way? 
Oh, no, shit. No, it's not our way. Is it... Do you know what? I'm going to go on a limb and say it's this way. And I would probably be wrong. Da, da, da. Nope, that's very wrong. Okay. Oh, I can't tell you how wrong I am. That's a dead end. This is... Not the way either. No, very much not the way. Okay. This way. Dead end, dead end. To me fashion, let's save. Dungeon key, great. Okay. There's not I see what... Yeah, okay. Oh, shit. Right, okay, yeah, I get it. I see it. And then that key I just found... Hey, Kenny's friend! That key I just found opens... Opens this gate here. Yeah. Which then takes us into here. Which I'm guessing is close to the big beastie. Right, there's one there I haven't activated, but I can't get across there because I will die. I don't have the right key. Okay. Is there a box around here? No. Nothing. Back in. That, I fall to my death. There's a torch there that I have not ignited. There's nothing in these rooms. Kenny was there, or Kenny's friends was there. Oh, hang on. Yeah, there you go. Dungeon key, thank God for that, because I was thinking, I've, pretty, I've explored this pretty well. I have no idea where that key might be. Right, let's crack on. Oh! I love the sound he makes when he deflates, when he hits a, a spike and deflates slightly. Right. There's a torch behind that over there I just saw. Bloodstone. Kenny's friend. Let's, there it is. Right, let's get the item on the go, reignite my torch. Okay, don't have the right key for there. Let's keep exploring. Science says use the oddly shipped skull in this hole. Oh, dungeon pizza. Is that different to normal pizza? Apart from it just being found in the dungeon. Hey, friend. Okay, cool. That's a hundred swings on that rusty sword. Found a dungeon key. Perfect. That's trippy going back. Going forward, you're lined up correctly. Going backwards, you're misaligned. Interesting. Clever. I like it. 
just wasting my uh Okay. So that was the oddly shaped skull. Can you imagine if you don't find the oddly shaped skull? And then you go that way to find that you can't progress and you've got to go all the way back to get the oddly shaped skull. My god. What's this? Sadness into madness. Right. Ah, torch. Sweet. Ah, bloodstone. Right. Excuse my uh, camera looking everywhere. My hand is cramping slightly on the mouse. Right, nowhere. Oh, not down there. Okay, let's keep going. Is. Oh, dead end. Came from that way, didn't I? Yes, I did, yeah. Okay, let's go back that way. Right. Let's keep going. Gold key. I haven't got one of those. Where's my jump button? There. Okay. No! Ah! <laughs> no! annoying I think I'm quite close as well to getting that key and to actually um, getting a bit further out of that out of that dungeon so let's keep on going back let's keep on going through it I'm just gonna put the light on here where am I now okay let's oh rearrange myself on this chair okay yeah I see where I am not too far behind actually doing pretty okay dungeon key and then back there, back there, to there, to there, to there. And then this time, I'm not gonna make the same mistake as last time and continue without getting that key first. Right, let's go, let's go. Kenny's friend! Right, okay. Open sesame! That. And then, oh, do you think I can remember where to go? I literally did it less than five minutes ago. There you go, perfect. I got a feeling I'm missing something. Oh yeah, okay. I haven't equipped my uh, torch, have I? So let's equip the torch and get the torch going. Sweet. Right. If I've got that torch on, do I need my flashlight? No. There we go. Cool. Bloodstone. Just keep pushing. Dungeon key. I didn't go this way before, did I? Where are we going now? Ah! Interesting. To energizers. That's the one I couldn't get to before. Sweet. Really glad about that because that was really annoying me that I couldn't get to it. Right, okay, perfect. So we're now. Yeah, that way. Sweet. 
torches in here, isn't there, if I remember? Yeah. And there's a box here. Yeah, there you go. T. Sadness into madness. Kenny's friend. Sweet. a bit of a tumble. Can't get to either of those, can I? No. Okay, let's keep going then as we are. The difference I'm going to make here is I'm going to have a quick drink as I save this. There we go. Perfect. Let's ignite that. Let's find the energizers in that. And then we go back. Now, the last time we came to a gold door, didn't we? A gold key door. I didn't have a cold gold key. And I, if I remember correctly, I haven't picked one up this time either. Where are we headed? There's the gold key door. Right, okay. So I've got to find a key, a gold key to open up that door. And this is where I fell to my uh, my death, wasn't it, last time? So keep on going around. I think it was there, actually, wasn't it, when I died? Okay, now, I do remember there was one place I didn't go. I ran... I can't go that way. I can't go that way. Okay. Right, okay. Kenny's friend was there. Torch was up here. A box was there. I keep going. where that torch was. Okay. I mean, I don't imagine that it would require me to come all the way back here to find that gold key, would it? I would have thought that the gold key would be more in the area that I was in and not come back to this area to find it. But you never know. That's just a torch, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. I don't want to go too far in case I can't find my way back. Yeah, I've opened all this. Opened all this. Opened all that. Opened all this. That's back in the beginning. There's Mr. Happy Skeleton Guy. All this has been done. Happy with the progress of all this. But I... Oh! Oof. That was close. I just can't find that gold key. So it has to be around about here. So if I just have a quick, that's, right, that's that lamp, uh, the torch that I couldn't get to without going the long way. 
and then that's a box I've already opened. And then that was just a torch. Oh, Kenny. I know one of Kenny's friends. And then here was, this was the, yeah, the path there that I've been. There's nothing there. But it has got a gold, gold pillars. Is that just to put me off, I wonder? Probably is to make me think the gold key is in there when it's not. All there is is just that one box, isn't it? Yeah. That's it. So, that's the gold box. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. That's the one I opened. What's this way? Spider's web. Come on. Ah, I remember. Kenny's friend. Another hungry, uh, another hungry sword. No, another rusty sword. With a hundred swings this time, not fifty like the last. This is a new area, surely. What? Oh, this is the other side of where I was a couple of minutes ago. Think about this. That one, I can't jump anywhere else. That one. I can't jump anywhere else. Okay. That's the other way, isn't it? Yeah, okay. So, if I was to jump there, to jump there, to come across one, to jump there, to jump there, to jump there, and get the gold key? Yes! No, jump there, save it. <laughs> yeah, save it. Right, save that. Right, cool. And then, jump there, jump there, move across to jump there, to jump there. Right. Okay, on, I'm not going to say easy street, but you know what I mean, you know what I mean. I'm going to go this way, which way am I going to go? Uh, that's the, the skull, isn't it? And I had to use the weird shaped skull to get the key, that was open, and then that was Kenny's friend. Whoa! Oof. God, my heart was in my mouth then. I thought I'm going to be loading that game back up sooner than you can say. Why the hell did you do that, you stupid idiot? You died. Right. I think it's this way. But I'm not too sure. Right. Bouncy, bouncy. Yeah, there we go. Look. Beautifully. Two energizers, and then this way. And then. Okay, put him into the light. Put him into the light. No weapons can hurt him. Put him into the light. Well, I can't really put him into the light, can I? Because. A, he's already in the. He is, no, he's not already in the light, is he? Hang on. Great, that's closed. Of course it has. No. Good. 
Oh no, not good. Where did you go? Why did you do that? Come on, follow me here. Follow me here? Yeah, good. Follow me there. And then I can shoot you down that hole and push you backwards. Yeah. Or you want to go down that one? Don't really, you're not really cooperative, are you? You don't really look as if you want to go down any of them. Let's get an item on the go. I need more, more health. Second chance orb though. I think I managed to get him down there once, didn't I? Oh my god. But he wouldn't go down there any anymore. Which is really quite annoying. Come on stand next to the fiery pit with me, mate. Said, isn't it? Is put him into the light. illuminated him I've I've hit him with everything that I've got well that's all I've got um, I want to play some different music is what I want to do and then I've got a torch. And I've got no option to use the torch as a weapon to shine in front of him. So let's. He's got to go down these holes he has. Oh, good! Oh my god, seriously? Yes, dude! That's amazing. Did not want. Ah, oh, do you know what? I didn't expect him to go down that easy. I was honestly wondering what the hell to do. He was tough. He was tough, man. But we had superposition by our side, so we good. I 
right now to get the hell out of here. Totally screwed up the easy way and gone the hard way. Oh no, it wasn't that way, was it? That's the skull. Nah, let's just keep going this way. It's a bit longer, but I guess it's out to where we need to be. Right. There we go. I mean, now we've got the password as well, though. Perfect. So now we've got the password. So now we can get that box open and we go back. Right. We can go back. Let's get some music on the go. And then we can go back, can't we? And then... So who have we listened to so far? So we've had... I don't have that song. Okay. What other song? I thought I did have that song. Okay, we've had... Florian Rocks. What have I got, actually? Don't have a circus recipe yet. Have I got Frostbit? Yes. Sweet. Let's get some water as we here. Right. Nice. Sweet, sweet water. There's nothing else over here I've missed? Nope. And let's get that. That's right. Yeah. And we get a pizza. Sweet. Right. So, let's have a look. Where are we? Where have we got to go? Where have we been? What have we got left? So, we have got... We're in 08. So, oh. Eight. Yeah, so we're there. So we can go to. We've been to the old castle. We haven't been to the scrapyard, have we? Have we been to the scrapyard? I don't think we have. Um, crash site. We've been to Pinewood Low. We've gone to the Dino Sea. We've been to Ancient Highlands. We haven't been actually to the. Um, wherever that. So uh, where was that? Um. The desert. We didn't go all the way through the desert, did we? Right, let's turn off this flashlight. So, let's go back to where we were and see if there's another way through that we haven't been, because so far all of this was new. Back into the forest. Right, no way out that way. Is that a new friend? Yes! Pet Tooby. Very affectionate. Oh, he looks a bit angry. <laughs> oh, he talks as well. I think he's got a bit of an attitude. I like him.
There's a box there. Oh no! I wasn't standing on it though, was I? Oh, well, maybe I was. Maybe that's what the green was illuminating me to. The fact that I was standing on it. No! Where did I save this? Did I... Oh no, did I save this? Oh no! Oh yeah, when I was leaving, wasn't I? Is this when I was leaving? Don't know. Anyway, folks, I think I'm going to leave it there. We've had a really, really, really great look at this game. There's going to be more coming. I'm going to wait now until the next update, and then we'll we'll carry on from where we left off in this game, and we'll we'll keep on doing this this as a as a like a almost like a uh, almost like a video series until the game is released on April 28th. At which case, um, I'm hoping we would have completed it by that point. All right, then, my friends. Thanks ever so much for watching. Don't forget, please check out the description. Check out Sloppy Joe Studios. Check out all the bands. Even if I didn't manage to get all of their tapes, we'll go back through and we will get them all at some point. All right, then. Take care, folks. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.